We recording? Alright. I just want to start off by saying, bro, I'm tired of shit. Tired of what? What? Man? I had some Chipotle, bro. Mm-hmm. My, I'm fucking leaning, bro. <laughs> Your stomach hurt? Nah, it's not my stomach hurt, but like, you know you got the itis? Oh, you got the itis. My shit lean. I'm bro, leaning, bro. Let me, let, me, let me tell you something. I went to, before I came here, I went to the Soul Food restaurant. Where? That's why, that's why, um, 22. Oh, yeah, speaking of that, my fault. There's a new soul food place on 22? Yeah, I can Yeah, it, I forgot what it's called. It's, uh, I went with my girl. It's called, like, something sweet, something. Soul food. That shit How far is rocking. it? It's not far. Is it new? I don't think it's new. What the hell? I just looked on it in the map. Like, I just looked it up in the map or whatever. That like, sounds fire. It's fire. I need that. It's fire. I went, I, to, the, I got the I went to the Chipotle by Keen, and I tried the new chicken. That shit was actually pretty good. Chipotle yeah. by Keen is so good. That's the only Chipotle that I go to. It's good, niggas. but like the service, like them niggas, them kids be lo- taking long as fuck. For real? Yeah, like they just be like, let they like. They be busy all the time over yeah, there. Yeah, the lines be long as shit. Yeah. And there's a, I don't know if you've seen, there's like a new barbecue place over there. No. There's like barbecue? a, it's like brand new, it's like a barbecue <laughs> shop. Like it's like a family owned barbecue restaurant. I'm like, hmm. Is it good? I don't know. I want to try it. That should look good. Yeah, no, I don't need that. I don't even get Chipotle no more because I've had bad experiences. Like what? Just nasty. It, oh, it that just, it, just it, it wasn't hitting. That's how it be. You know, you know how you begin Chipotle the first time, first couple of times, and then it's just like, oh, this shit good, and then <laughs> it's just it, it hasn't been hitting for the past few months. It'd be like that. And I had that one from Keen one time. Fire. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. All right, what's your order? What's your order? Just be getting. I I get the bowl all the time. Okay, okay, okay. I get the bowl all the time. Corn, green salsa, green chili salsa, sour cream, cheese, steak, and chicken. Hmm. Uh, that's yeah, not bad. That's, that's not really bad. that's really it. I, I used, my I, girl put me on. That's it though. That's not bad. That's fine. I used to eat the um, like the sofritas. It's like tofu. Oh yeah, you told me about that. <laughs> shit, bro. Nobody about to order no sofritas. <laughs> it's not bad, bro. But like today, I had the chicken. Know, what about that, some tofu? It's like some pollo. As- Jay, how you say that shit? Pollo asado. Pollo asado. Pollo asado. I, oh, yeah. I, pe- I seen that on the menu. That shit rocking. Seen, it's good. That shit good as fuck. It's like That's the new chicken. Mm-hmm, it's like spicy lime. You got like a hint of lime. And it's like spicy. That shit rock. It like the other chicken got like. I don't like the other chicken. Like you could get it in the bowl, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Cool. Like it got more flavor than the other chicken. That shit rocking. But I'm uh, but I'm gonna look. I'm gonna I'm gonna check that out. Get some chips and guac on the side, bro. See, I don't really get the chips like that. Really? Why? I'm not really. A, I don't know. I'm not, You're not really chips the, chip, the chip guy. Not their chips. I don't really get that chip uh, and guac. Yeah, it'd be like that. that. I like their chips because they put like lime and salt on that shit. Mm. It's all right, yeah, it's all but right. sometimes it it don't be salty and it be. Ass. Yeah, nah, I'm not gonna lie, it be hit or miss. Some people like sometimes they let it like sit in like the lemon juice exactly. and it gets soggy and now it be crunchy. Yeah, that's why that'd I be don't. blowing mine. That's why I don't. I'm be getting it like that. It'd be like that. It'd be like that. But yo, 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 welcome back to another episode of No Records Podcast, episode number thirty two, bro. Who is number thirty two? Uh, Magic Johnson. Damn, you quick. I didn't even know. Quick, I was gonna quick. say Carl Malone or some shit. Magic Johnson, right? Yeah, no, no, no. I think yeah, it's yeah. 32. I think it's 32. I think it's 32. <laughs> I but 32, episode number 32, man. If you haven't already, follow us on TikTok at No Regulars. We at 122,000. Mm-hmm. That's fire. That's fire. That's so bro. tough. That's, That's so fire. tough. Hey, maybe we'll get more after this episode. We will. We will. Yeah, Mr. Fritz has like 3 million views on all his shits. I don't know why. We ain't hating, though. It sounds like you hating. <laughs> <laughs> you talk about that. It ain't me, bro. I don't know why, but. I don't know why neither. I mean, it, he talk about me like I be I be the one that's really talking. Hey, that's bro, it's really us. It's, it's us, man. It's us. But I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Hey, people, let me know where y'all be listening. Like, do you, do y'all do y'all listen to us in the morning? Like when y'all go to work? Because I I think that's kind of you know where I be listening. Like we to. the we the first thing we y'all y'all hear in the morning. <laughs> on the way I hope home. not. <laughs> You talk crazy. about you talk about you like UJ talk about zombie apocalypse. Nah, yeah, bro, this what y'all ain't no way. Nah, really? I, I be I be listening like when I when I when I work at uh, shop right, I listen to you. Oh, okay, this, okay. Uh, and when I'm on the game, I be listening. Oh, okay, to you. okay, that's tough. So that's I don't tough. know I don't know about anyone else, but hey that's man, how I do let it. us know when y'all listen to us, man. If you haven't already, follow uh follow us on Instagram also at noworks I think we're at like three fifty. 350 followers. That's not bad. Yeah, Yeah, it's not bad. 
And follow all the podcasts and platforms at No Regulars Podcast on Apple Music, Spotify, Google Podcasts, all that good stuff. And if you haven't already, if you're new to the channel, subscribe down below. We at 1.2 thousand. That's pretty good. That's fire. That's tough. That's, That's tough. Fire. Uh, send it to a friend and tell them to send it to a friend, all that weird shit. And um, like comment. the video, comment. Yeah. If you want to DM us, bro, you could DM Fritz. I don't know why y'all got to keep DMing me. <laughs> you could DM me? Yeah, go DM Fritz, bro. Go, nah, don't go. DM me, bro. Don't well, DM me. If y'all want to argue with us, argue with Fritz. Argue with me? Yeah, bro. You'll lose. <laughs> what are you talking about? Don't argue with me. <laughs> you say you'll lose. Nah. Nah, go argue with Fritz, bro. I think y'all win. Yeah. But yeah. Oh, write a re- uh, people, if y'all want to, you can write a review for us. You know, it helps us go in the algorithm more. And I think yes, I think since, I think we got like 12 reviews. We got 12 we got twelve on Apple. We have a lot on Spotify. It's like probably like twenty something. Oh, for real. Yeah, we got. You know, what, you know what it is. I, I I never, not trying to be. You know, I never really um listen to any of the uh, podcasts. So, oh, know, on the I, the I, app. I, app? Yeah, I be I, all right. <laughs> it's weird. Like I can't watch my own podcast. You can't. I really like watching it. Like I, maybe it's because like I work on it every day. Yeah, you. And like I know it. what's about to happen. Makes That's probably sense. the only reason why. Makes sense. Makes sense. So it's like I only listen to it like if I don't have nothing else to listen to, or like if I want to hear how it sounds. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's the only way I listen to it. Yeah, it makes sense. I be listening to this, uh, this dude from Philly. That what's, nigga is hilarious. His name? his name's uh, it's called Listen to Why You Shit. His name's uh Dom Sharp. That that boy is hilarious. That feel, yeah, he's he be having me crying, bro. This t- <laughs> I feel like I feel like I, uh, he's been on my for you. Page yeah, you probably seen him before, just talking shit about yeah. people. Yeah, like talking, like. he was talking shit about Jack Harlow. For real? Yeah, he said Jack Harlow get too many black women. He does. <laughs> I completely agree. That's crazy. <laughs> he really, he really like be making like black women like want like a white guy. Like, be like damn, <laughs> not not trying to be rude or nothing, but damn. He say he about to dig up some dirt off Jack on Jack Harlow. It, he been racist the back N-word. in the day. Yeah, <laughs> he say he couldn't find nothing. <laughs> I be crying, bro. Uh, I believe Jack Harlow been has said nigga a few hey, times. Hey, bro. Shit. Does he have the N the N word card? The Jack Harlow, card. yeah, you got the nigga card. I fuck with Jack Harlow. I fuck with him too. I think he's a cool dude, bro. I think he's a cool dude. Is he? Is he one of the brothers? Yeah, <laughs> I think. So. Hey, I, I, I'll let him say nigga. Hey, I can't. Oh damn! <laughs> <laughs> let him say it. That's crazy. <laughs> All right, bro. But we got a good episode for y'all today. We got a lot of good things to talk about. But first, I want to talk about this. We I've been wanting to talk about this for a while, cause me and Fritz, bro, we frauds, man. <laughs> He's a fraud. <laughs> you a fraud right there with me, bro. He's a fraud. I'm like, not me, a fraud. If you want to see our IGs, bro, like them followers, a good, I, I wouldn't say a thousand because I feel like. Nah, not a thousand. I say 400 of them don't Wait, know who honestly, we are. Honestly, it's probably close to a thousand. You know how many people. All right, people, let, this is the backstory. So, freshman year of high school, me and Fritz used to. uh like <laughs> we wanted to get our followers up. <laughs> How many followers do you think you had? I think I had like Dang, I probably had like seven hundred. Yeah, seven hundred? Maybe four. Maybe maybe seven, six hundred. Yeah, I think I had like five, five hundred or something like that. Around. And that was the time when Instagram just came out. Just everybody came was on Instagram. Popping. Everybody if you had like a thousand followers on Instagram, you, you fire. Was cool. You tough. You was tough. Those are the days when people used to have like the little uh to be honest post underneath the thing. Hell yeah, bro. Those are the times, Cringy, cringy, bro. cringy, cringy. cringy. <laughs> but anyways, you me- remember when they just had like Instagram wives, Instagram. Yeah, so it was so it was weird, bro. Weird day, weird times, bro. But anyway, so me and Fritz wanted to, uh, you know, get our followers up. So we made a plan. So we found out you could follow a lot of people. There's like a max amount of people you could follow, right? Mm-hmm. And like once you hit that max, then you can't follow nobody. So we used to follow mad people and wait till they follow us back. Mm-hmm. And then we would unfollow them. Hell yeah. and, and, and around the time, like there was also, I think there was an app that would track yeah. if you would, you know, if a person followed you back and if they didn't. So everybody that didn't follow me back. Just like unfollowed. You're getting bro. unfollowed. So like, I'm not gonna lie. I used to wake up in the morning with like 400 follower requests. Yo, I used to think I was who tough. Are you telling, bro. <laughs> and the thing is, that would make my day. It would. It, it would really make would. my day. Like it I'd really be like, would, yo, I'm almost close. I would literally have like you know my bio. Yeah. Like I would have like um one one k <laughs> check two <laughs> k. Check and then the three K was wasn't even checked because you know that's when I really stopped doing that. Yeah, you kept going. I stopped at like yeah, you stopped twelve hundred. Yeah, 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 you stopped. You stopped. Or maybe not. Maybe fifteen hundred. I think I stopped. I was at two thousand. I think the most was at like two thousand 
three hundred something. <laughs> I was I was clicking. And that way, what are you at right now? No nah, hell no, I went all the way down. Like what? Are you, what number are you at? <laughs> I'm at a thousand. <laughs> <laughs> you find out like who is this? Video? Hell of people off uh, follow me, bro. <laughs> but because uh let me, let me tell you, like around um shit, I'll say around junior year. Yeah. Like oh before like junior year or before like around uh before um junior year and shit, like yeah. social media was like like I love social media. I like, think everybody I, did like I, a lot. Yeah, like I really wanted to like I wanted I was feeding for likes. Every every photo that didn't reach a hundred, I'm You deleted deleting. it. I swear <laughs> to God, I deleted. Like <laughs> it's crazy. It was hard, but I it was, was feeding hard. for so around junior year, I think I either lost my password, forgot my password, and or got hacked because I couldn't get into the that account no more. And it's the same account that I'm using right now. So I don't know how I got back, you know, Damn, got bro. it back. But that's tough. I came back. And first of all, there, nah, it had to be hacked because there was some posts that I never posted. I think it was hacked. Cause I remember you used to post, used to post some weird shit. Yeah. There was some posts that I never yeah, posted. It was, and like, was, it was like uh, flyers. Exactly. And there was, there was, um, yeah, flyers. And mm-hmm. there was, um, followers that I never, you know, Never like, seen. I've never seen. Like I just, I just knew I never followed. That's them. how it be, bro. Like people be hacking Instagrams nowadays. Yeah. Like and why do you need to hack an Instagram? That's a, that's like, some, what, that's some childish exactly, shit, bro. Especially like it's like some Instagram that it's not worth nothing. Exactly. Like I don't got you like know? I don't got no verified I don't check. Got no verified check. Like what you, what what you gotta do? Like what you gonna do with that? Like come on, it's it's just weird. Oh, yeah, so I right. so like you know when people be sending the links, I never click them links. Hell no. I would never click that link. Hell, Hell no. no. So that's why nope. I, it, I be I be I be feeling bad, but yet like how do you fall for that? How do you fall for that? I don't like know, come bro. on. You know what it is? It was it would be like uh people's friends so like they will hack your friends and then they will send it to you thinking that like you think it's them yeah but then they'll they'll um they don't know your name so they, they'll be like yeah hi your username yeah, instead of yeah, saying your yeah. actual name people so are dumb though like, yeah but why y'all fall for that shit yeah but <laughs> and all like i came back and my my followers are all all down and and now i'm at a thousand now i don't really care for social media yeah, like that I, no more so we just live in our lives bro, you know what i'm saying yeah just going up day by day i was definitely sad when i couldn't get in that so <laughs> I, 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 no, don't get me wrong like i wanted to cry like it'd be like that bro. you know but i don't know about dude, crying crying might be a little crazy i ain't want to cry i'm gassing <laughs> but I, I was really sad about it Okay, bro. Cause I cared about that shit. I was like, damn, I was almost at three thousand. Bro, we grinded oh. for that shit. We grinded for like a days. good like month. For a long time. It was a long time. We we would just be in lunch, just following people. I'm like, yo, Fritz, you follow this person? Following, bro, <laughs> just clicking. Random. I don't know none of these people. Just clicking, bro. Ah oh, man. And I would go. <laughs> we I would go to the people who I, who I followed account. Go to their followers, mm-hmm. click on that. Just click, click on, on everything that. until I couldn't click no more, oh, bro. God, bro. That's just how just went. waiting for like the, the the shit to come up, bro. That's how it went, bro. Man, that's how it went. But hold on, I got a uh, I got a would you rather question, bro. Yeah. So would you rather every year on your B day, you have to survive from someone like trying to kill you, or like on your birthday you have to save like a loved one from being killed. So I gotta survive every day for somebody who's trying to kill me or or save a loved one. Yeah. Every day on your birthday. Like it depends. Like, is he like a professional like bounty hunter type shit? Like, hey, it's it's whatever, bro. It's whatever. Yeah, it's just somebody. It might be somebody new every year, but somebody trying to. Get I think you. I think I'm a I'm a try to. I'm a try to I'm a try to survive myself. Yeah, I was about to say that because it's like if. If, if that you know, I'm gonna get accustomed to it. So mm-hmm. then I'm gonna try to find new ways to you know maneuver around it, or yeah, try to yeah. try to you know try to save my own ass. But it's like if it's somebody else, I feel like like one year they might catch me lacking. I yeah. forget. Oh, for real? Yeah, I feel nah, like I don't think I'm. A, or how maybe you gonna not, forget. Maybe not for. I look, look, look. Somebody <laughs> trying to kill you every year. Not me, but forget. like if I pick like I wouldn't pick like my loved ones because I feel like like damn like what if like. I know it's not happening to me, but like, what if like it's my birthday? I'm celebrating. I'm like, wait, and oh, you shit. don't exactly. That's and, crazy. And, and you're like, oh, it like somebody 
trying to kill like you know yeah my somebody, brother or something yeah that shit happen they got but, me, damn i'll be so sad what if you don't know what loved ones like they're trying to come that's what i'm saying too. like it might come for y'all niggas it might come from jay like that i can't you, i'd rather you me, don't bro. know i'd rather, I'd rather go through that shit. yeah I might, I might as well go through that yeah, I, I hide, I'm not hide i'll you know i'll find a way because because like you heard there was a youtuber that did like this little challenge thing like he hired like a, a bounty hunter to like mr yeah, beast it might have been Mr. Beast. Jay told me. Yeah. So like he hired like a bounty hunter to like try to get him, and within a day, and the guy literally just changed his face and like went up to him as like a, a cameraman and was working with him. Oh, that's crazy. I would be. <sighs> that's crazy. I don't think that was Mr. Beast because like, I watched I watched that video. Nah, that Mr. Beast video. Bro, he, that bounty hunter did that's not do some that. Cheese, that's crazy, bro. That that's is tough. cheese. <laughs> like that's that, tough. That, be like, and then he just t- took his mask and was like, oh, I got you. Imagine a person did that shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, he just... It's over, like bro. That? It's That's over. Tough. That's all. Man. But that just goes into my other thing, bro. <laughs> what you laughing at? Why was Anne Frank so famous? <sighs> <laughs> what you mean, why was Anne Frank so like, famous? Like, give me a reason why she was so famous. Didn't she make books? Yeah, she okay. She wrote diaries about how she was hiding from the Germans. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm not mean to be ignorant, people. I love Anne Frank. Remember we used to read them books back in the yeah, day. Yeah, we read them books back in the day. There's no way you, yo. Oh, I'm not saying fuck? it's a bad thing, but I'm just saying it's just like, like what she just they just hiding, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> Wait. Okay. It, wasn't she deaf and blind? Ain't no way she deaf and blind writing some good novels like nah, that. Nah, for real. I, wasn't she deaf and blind? No way. She, <laughs> and Frank was deaf and blind, bro. <laughs> no way she hid that long. <laughs> <laughs> I go, what? Bro, she was famous because of, you know, those, those diaries. I think those specific diaries, didn't they, like, they found them, didn't they? That's just a lucky bunch. You know how I many diaries they probably made? People probably made? Yeah, but hers are probably, like, the more significant. Like, she, I think she talked about, like, everything. Like, what? Like That went, that went, that was going on, like, you know. I bet you a slave was, was doing on. the same thing. They ain't right. They ain't but publish you know that book. they don't give a fuck That's about that That's craziness, bro. Like, you no, know they don't give a fuck about Like, was it good literature? They don't what if somebody just rewrote that. that shit? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> so, what do you, so, what do you think? What, what, no, what I feel you? like, I feel like she was hiding. Like I feel like she was in mortal danger. Okay, but, but just, why do you think she's famous? I mean, I just feel like it's just a. I think she's famous because it's like another point of view, but it's not. That's it what I'm saying. It shouldn't be that. Like, like we read that in what middle school? Yeah, was, middle school. No, no, might have been. Was it middle school? Or was Anne Frank? School? Yeah, the Diaries of Anne Frank. Like, I, I don't. Think it was do you remember? School. Hell no. I don't remember none of that shit. It could have been that good. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like I, I nah, I I don't remember it. That's what I'm saying. Like, I just remember like what. Like who she is, like of course, but I don't remember. All I remember was that she hid in the attic. Yeah, yeah I remember from that. the Germans. I remember that. So how, like, how she get caught? How did she get caught? I think I remember. Um, somebody did tell me. Uh, <laughs> my, uh, <laughs> what's her name? I think I think my English teacher did tell me how she got caught. But nigga, I do not give a fuck. That's a fact. I don't care. <laughs> like, like, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I'm with sorry, you. Like, bro. I'm sorry they had to go through not, that. Not trying. Nah. Sorry that they had to go through that. That's that shit crazy. But honestly, but I don't care. <laughs> not trying to be. <laughs> not, try, oh, not trying to be rude because it's like yeah, we're not ignorant people. We just this we're is all re- jokes. We're, we're really not ignorant, but it's just like I mean I am ignorant to the fact like I'm <laughs> I'm ignorant to the fact like I don't know like why she is famous or what what's <laughs> her significance throughout history. I don't know. But and I'm I'm thinking like, so how did how did they get the diaries out? So they captured the they cap they seen her in the attic. Mm-hmm. All right, she has diaries. So did she give it to somebody? Damn. Did she throw them out the window? Like, Damn. what? How they get them? Maybe maybe some maybe I think we're forgetting a really key piece. And that's we might sound mad saying. dumb. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> we're probably forgetting something. Maybe somebody. Wait, did everybody in the attic die? I think so. I think it was like her. I think she had. I think she had like a brother, a sister, and her parents, and they all Everyone found her. Like I'm just wondering, like, how in the world did they find them? Maybe uh, you know what? Maybe they was going through through the towns and like they check check everything. Because you know how 
you know how um Adolf Hitler like he he made his own um like you know what it's called Mein Kampf his it's called My Life oh like yeah the, the book he made his own book yeah so you know how people I think somebody in his in his team or somebody uh, found it. And then uh, publish oh, it. Publish it? Oh, so you like probably that. the same thing about that? It's probably the same thing about that. I guess. I guess too, but hey. it's like. I'm just saying, I don't, bro. She was deaf and blind, right? No, she she couldn't have been deaf. I think no she way was. In hell, bro. I think she was. I'm about to look this shit up. Ain't no way. No, or am no I way, tripping? No way she survived. No, okay. No way she hid from the Nazis. <laughs> Published a, a diary, bro. She she did it herself because um, what you calls it? She had help, bro. What the hell? No way. Anne Frank was not blind. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> what she did? Anne Frank she was, was deaf, not though. deaf. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. What the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> how the hell she didn't get caught earlier? You blind and deaf, bro. <laughs> like how you gonna walk around? Who the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> you talking about Albert Einstein? Who the hell? You talking about Beethoven? <laughs> nah, Be- Beethoven was only deaf. Wait, was Beethoven like music? Yeah. Stupid nigga. <laughs> Beethoven was let's only talk music. About, let's talk about that shit too. That's yeah, some no, dumb ass no, shit. That, that, is, that is weird. Like, how did he possibly like know like <laughs> how to compose without hearing the music? Like, That's what I'm saying. Wait, wasn't he a little blind too? <laughs> Come on, bro. Like, no way. No way. No way. People back then was doing this ass. <laughs> no way. Be- Beethoven. I can't even spell. How the fuck you spell that shit? B e t h o. Beethoven. Beethoven. What you said? Blind? No way. He was blind. There's no way. I think he was. No way. There's no way in hell he was blind, bro. Uh, I think he, he was just deaf. Yeah. Uh, so Bro, I hated um, uh, learning about Beethoven and music. Uh, fifth grade, bro. Like who? I don't give a fuck neither, bro. Hmm. Like I, I hated, I hated that shit. Like it was dumb. Mozart, Beethoven. Like who? I hate classical I'm, music. I'm not gonna I lie. If you listen class- to classical music like for fun. You're really like you're, a, you're a psycho. You're, you're a psycho. strange, bro. It's like. First of all, I, I'm not trying to be rude or nothing, but it's like, who cares, bro? <laughs> who cares? It's just, hey, it's just our opinions, bro. Yeah, like, it's like, just like people, like, how in the world is Beethoven? Like, that just blows my mind. How is he? Like, how y'all praise Beethoven so much? And he can't even hear what he's he playing. Can't even hear nothing, bro. When and niggas is talking about no, nah, but that that also. I mean, maybe that, that makes it better. That makes it yeah better. You know, like, like damn, like he can't even hear, and you know he's composing and shit. Bro, I don't know, man. And actually, I think okay, maybe I think he became deaf. So, oh, like, so I think he didn't start off. Yeah, deaf. he didn't start off deaf. So For he. Real? Oh, so you started losing this. Yeah. Losing All right, I guess he got a pass. No, he got. He definitely got a pass. He got a pass. But oh, I was thinking about this the other day too, right? Like food critics is the most finesse job ever. Finesse job. Like ever. a food critic, because like something good. Something could be bad to you, but good to another person. Oh yeah, that, that's it true. makes no sense. Oh yeah, that's like true. like Food Network, like uh, Iron Chef, mm-hmm. all them like Gordon Ramsay, all that shit. Oh yeah, that's true, right? Like, it could be nasty to him, but, but to me, be, that'd be rocking. Yeah, it could be, it could be good. Yeah. So why why does his you know his, I, I understand why his word holds so much weight because it's Gordon Ramsay and yeah, and, but like, but it's like still like who gives a fuck what you think exactly like. like like my, I would not want to go on that show, to you know, be honest. Yeah, yeah. Like people that I actually, you know, fuck with might think my shit is rocking. Yeah. And you you thinking my sh- you telling me my shit is nasty and shit. Like, like that, I don't understand. Like weird. people be going crazy. Nah, it, it is a finesse, to be honest. Like you could like just, how you gonna tell this nigga? Like this nigga's been hearing that his food is rocking for years. Exactly. And then you go tell him you disgusting. go tell him it's nasty. Like how like Come why on, you gonna son. believe one person? Like you Come that on, one son. person that maybe like like every five hundred people says that. Exactly. And so that like, and but that that one person, you know how people get that's gonna get into their head and be like, man. damn. That's a damn shame. And it's Gordon Ramsay, so it's like, damn, it holds I tell, weight. I tell Gordon Ramsay eat a Frank, bro. Nah, that's a fact. <laughs> tell me. Like, you gonna tell me my shit ass? Like, how you gonna tell me my shit ass, bro? Everybody like I got three restaurants, everybody love my food except exactly. you. But except you. Get the Come fuck on, out bro. of here. I, I I wouldn't really give a fuck to be honest. Mm, bro. I wouldn't care. But Oh, another thing. I got I'm starting off the show a hella hate. 
<laughs> this is crazy. I know yeah, that Anne Frank thing. You came from a would you rather? <laughs> and then you was like, <laughs> why is Anne Frank famous? <laughs> like, damn. <laughs> All right, I got another one, bro. Romeo and Juliet. Mm-hmm. The dumbest plot ever. Dumbest plot. The fact that the, <laughs> the fact the fact that he um I, I think I think yeah she she faked her she faked the death. Yes. And then, and then she, he killed he woke, himself. He killed himself. He's a simp. So stupid. <laughs> He's a so simp. stupid. So stupid. <laughs> Freaking so killed stupid. himself. I hate. I hate Cause that. he thought his girl. Like first of all, y'all could. They could have just ran away. Yeah. They was like, nah. I, if I can't have you, no one could kill myself. Yeah. And then she's like, oh, you dead. Oh, and then he's like, oh, I was <laughs> kidding. Nigga the poison. <laughs> <laughs> girl woke up was like, see that nigga in the dead, like just straight like this, like. <laughs> she killed herself too. Like how is that good? Like yeah, that is so du- like Shakespeare. Come on. And you ever watched the movie? Uh, the D- Leonardo yes, DiCaprio. That movie was so yeah, ass. I, I didn't see. Yeah, uh, we. I think we watched it in class. I think we watched it in class. Yeah, like it was freaking. It was like in English. It was like modern day, but mm-hmm. it was like in Shakespeare talk. Yeah. Like, I was so confused. Yeah, yo, that's a fact. Like that because I think I remember a scene. It was on the beach or some, and it was. I don't remember, but nah. It was I, just speaking. It was, it like was, you could, I couldn't understand them. It was. It was. It was modern like times type shit. Modern times, but speaking in Shakespeare. Like who thought of that? Another yeah. one with Leonardo DiCaprio, freaking Titanic. Titanic. Ah. I, I like Titanic. The, the the ending was blew my shit. Really? He could have lived for it. You think so? For it, if she would have moved over a little bit, just you know, like come tad. on, like let's let's switch at least. Yeah, just a little tad. You, you should just gonna let him die, scoot o- like scoot over type shit. Yeah. But I, I, do you think he he had like you know the water was cold? Yeah. So you think like I think his legs would have been like, like was like you know. Fucked up other than his lower I mean, half. he could have. So found I don't know if he had the strength to even pull himself up. Find a way, bro. You think so? He could have found a way. Ain't no way they dying like that. Ain't no way I'm dying. First of all, now nah, I would I would give it my all. Exactly. I don't think he gave it his all. I think he just. I think. <laughs> <laughs> I think he just let her let her let her sit on that. Um, the the what was it, like a piece of drift. I think it was a like a, yeah, like a plank or something <laughs> like. <that. laughs> Like a like a wood wood and then he just let it rock because you know I bro, think it, that's I, yeah, pretty bro. ass that's pretty ass that's ass as hell come on bro like them movies be having me them movies them books be having me so mad All speaking the books of Shakespeare read. bro how do you think that nigga looked back in the day <laughs> remember I heard that that nigga was either like a female or that nigga was mm, that, he might have been the first he might have been the first one the first I don't know. I think he looked like from the picture. He looked kind of weird looking. He looked weird. I don't know. I he think he looked like a dweeb. He do like a dweeb. Like I don't know how. Why is this shit so? I mean, some of Shakespeare's wasn't that bad. Like I remember, I forgot what what shit we we read. Was it Beowulf? Beowulf wasn't. That Beowulf bad. was cool, but then I had to read it. Yeah, and and, and, and it was you know the language, Shakespearean, yeah. Shakespearean language. I didn't fuck with that, bro. Wait, I didn't fuck with that. Pause. Why Shakespeare has his own language? That's what I'm what saying. What made him so special? They got a, like. I'm, that's what I'm, why. These people are so dumb back then. That's what I'm saying. I would not bro. let that slide. Nah, bro. <laughs> I would nigga, not let that slide. Art bro. thou, this, that, and this third. You like, got me effed up. You think I'm doing all that stuff, bro? Nigga speaking like, come on, bro. Speaking in tongue and shit, like. Yeah. Come I on, fucked bro. with Beowulf. Uh, the plot though. I fucked with the plot. Yeah, it was I pretty just, good. I just didn't want to read. No, I don't think none of us want. Like we had to read Hamilton. I think we Hamlet. Read, Hamlet. Ham. Hamlet. I said Hamilton. Hamlet. I for, I don't remember that. I don't even remember reading that shit. I think Hamlet was about. Damn, I forgot, bro. Yeah, I forgot. Was Julius Caesar wasn't Shakespeare, right? Julius was a real person. Uh, yeah. Okay. Because I remember. I like that plot. That too. was pretty Mr. good. Mr. Kenny class. Yeah. That was fire. Yo, Mr. Kenny class. Yo, shout out Mr. Kenny. You think Mr. Kenny? Shit, I hope he listens to this. Shout yeah, out Mr. Shout, Kenny. Shout bro. out Mr. Kenny. Look, look at your students, bro. We all grown up now. Yeah, bro. It's that, been like what? That guy like, was the goat. I know, right? Crazy. Remember, yo, you just remind me. Remember that book we read? Uh, the with the kite. With the kite. Yeah, that, that was nigga a good book. got his. That nigga got raped. That <laughs> yo, he got <laughs> raped. That nigga got fucked in the alley. That's bro, tough. That was so. I was so sad. Max, I was bro. so sad. I felt bad I for felt him. So, bro. I think he got peed on too. He got raped, nigga. Bro, he said he was walking down. He had a trail of blood leaking from oh, his pants. That's it. Oh, that's it. In the snow. I'm sorry, people. Don't don't imi- don't imagine that. <laughs> it was bad times, bro. Yeah, that was that was a that was such a sad movie. Yeah, it was a sad such movie. Such a sad movie. We read some good books back in the day. We bro. did. We did. The ones that I actually read 
it means that it was, you know, it was pretty like good. it was pretty decent, bro. Like remember that book? I forgot what it's called. When the girl like died and she went to heaven and like she got to like see herself and like her family, like she was looking over them. Hell no. You don't remember? I think she like she got into like a car accident. Oh, they made a movie about that. Yeah, I forgot what it was called though. I forgot what it was called too. Yeah, but. Damn, I be forgetting. Shit, I know, bro. bro. We, we get, old. We get too damn old, bro. <laughs> we got too much information to recall, but nah, that's a fact. But I got, I got some things I want to talk about, bro. So it's like, it's scary facts about the world that I, I researched, and I just want to react to them. Okay. All right. So the first one is that according to the CIA, there's thirty to fifty serial killers left in the world, just roaming around the world. Third, you said thirty to thirty-five what? to fifty serial killers in the world. Serial. Okay, according to the CIA. According to the CIA. And they the haven't world. caught. Yes. Just think about it. <laughs> In the think, world? Yeah, just think about that. Maybe it's either the world or the U.S. If it's U.S., that's crazy. If it's crazy. U.S., that's scary. That's crazy. If it's the world, then okay. Let's say, let's just say it's U.S. <laughs> nah. Like, just imagine. Like, they probably just lived in the woods and just, like... That's why the kids are getting, like, abducted. Yeah, man. And, and honestly, that's probably the ones that they... Do you that's think the ones that's that the they, one they, they know. That's the ones they know about. There's, there's probably there's a bunch that there's just started a lot out. more. I feel like thirty to thirty fifty seems just so 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 like small. I, know. I feel like there's a lot of psychopaths, a lot more like just weird niggas, like Jeffrey shit. Dahmer type dudes. Yes, yeah, I think so. I feel like there's a lot more because honestly, it, it, it all it, it it all comes from the mental too. Like it's like you know, like I think there's a lot more just weirdos out there that I feel like be. I feel like those people like you know how you, it's like like you ever heard like there's like a study like you walk past like like in your yeah. lifetime you walk past like maybe like eight murderers eight, yeah so uh, it's like I feel like those serial people serial killer people they like were like isolated a lot when they was kids mm-hmm. and like they started exploring doing things and they start like you know you like I watched a Jeffrey Dahmer movie terrible mm-hmm. movie by the way nobody watched that it was wait, wait which one the one was Zac Efron no the one with was that Jeff? No, oh no, that's not Jeffrey Dahmer. That's, that's what's uh, his name. I forgot what his name was. Ted Bundy. Ted Bundy. Ted Bundy. No, Jeffrey Dahmer. It was the one with the guy from Austin Alley. Oh, yeah. that we. Oh yeah, I remember. That I movie remember. was ass. It was. Yeah, it was ass. Wow. Left left us on a cliffhanger. Got mad as fuck. Oh, that sucks. But so like he started out that, like Loki. That's a good person. To, uh, yeah, it was a good person. Him. Yeah, he looked like him. Yeah, he looked like him. He's that's crazy. That <laughs> <laughs> but like he started out killing like animals. Mm. Before he started like actually like getting humans and like he started yeah like, that that's a uh, that's one of the first uh, signs, signs. They're just killing animals to get a, happy of about a psychopath, it. Yeah, yeah. Like but. they just want to kill like cats and different rabbits and I shit. know, like, bro. You know, that's the first sign. It's weird, bro. It's freedom kids, man. Yeah, that sucks. All right, another fact is that you know there's dead bodies left on Mount Everest. Really? Yeah. Think about it. Like, I mean, there's no reason. I mean. There's no way to get. There's them. no way to get them. So like they're just left there. Yeah, they are. So people there. that climb up, you can, you might see. There's a high possibility you just see a dead body right there. Yeah, and you're just walking over it. Like I seen a I video. Know, I know. Uh, again, shout out Mr. Ballin. There was a guy, uh, that I think he he was he he. I don't know if it was. Oh my bad. I don't straight. know if it was Mount Everest, but you know he he was climbing a mountain. I think slip. And fell and shit like yeah. that. Got stuck inside, you know, uh, a pile of snow or something like yeah. that. You know, he died, laid there. He was wearing green boots. Mm-hmm. So people who go up there can see his body. Really? It's his uh, green boots or something like that. I don't know what color it was, mm-hmm. but, you know, his boots just stuck. Nah, that's crazy. That is. So, like, just so he just laid there. No one can get him, you know? Like, I know. Just, yeah, I feel you. But it's just like, that's creepy. It is creepy. Like, especially, like, I seen a video of somebody climbing up Mount Everest, and they was walking, like, across, like, the thing, and you see, like, it's, like, 10 feet away. It's just a body just frozen right there. Oh, for real? Yeah, I guess somebody just fell. Yeah, I mean, yeah. There's probably a lot of them drones. That's probably, that's a terrible way to die. I ain't gonna lie. And there's probably ones that are just, like... Underneath all the all the snow, all the snow. hell yeah! If that all that snow melts, how many bodies? There's probably hundreds of them. Hundreds. <clears throat> but, but this one is actually crazy. This would you wait? Hold on, real quick. What? Like, would you ever like climb a mountain? Yeah. Oh, depending on what mountain. Oh, oh wait, no, I'm not. I'm not climbing Mount Everest. Hell, hell no, no, not Mount Everest. That's like like a it could be, it could be like a, like a Mount Helen type shit. Like yeah, I, the, I don't know what the mountain's name is, but yeah, would you, you would climb a mountain? Uh, if if it, if it if it if I have to if it's a big enough mountain where I have to like sleep, like camp 
every time, I'm not doing it. But if it's like a medium sized mountain where I could just go to the top, I ain't doing that shit. <laughs> You're not gonna see me on top of my own mountain. Yes. You ever go go to the mountain top, bro? There's. <laughs> That's tough. Yo, you see, yo, you'll never see me hiking. You'll never see me do none of that. Hey, bro, we might go, we might go random nodding again. There's, I'm not doing that neither. <sighs> try God again. <laughs> try, try, <laughs> catch me. try again. Hey, people, try random nodding. It's, it's okay. It's not even real. It, it was, it, it was, it wasn't, it wasn't real. Except like, that there, there one was thing. Some little coincidences. Like with the the, the green and the with money. The green that money. was creepy. That was creepy. I thought that lady was chasing after us. I I thought that lady was chasing, and then I was looking at the car, you know, back, you know, back camera. And you didn't see it. I didn't see the bitch. But hey, people, if y'all don't know, like I talked about this in probably like French's first episode. We all went random we did, nodding. Right? Huh? We did, right? Yeah, we did. Uh-huh. But we all went random nodding and stuff. It was me, Fritz, uh, Jay, Ish, and Jordan, right? And Jeter. Shout out Jeter if you listen to the yeah, podcast. I don't know Jeter, if you do, bro. but shout but um, <laughs> but we went random nodding. So what random nodding is is just like it's an app, and you just have to manifest something, and it's gonna send you a location. It's gonna be whatever you manifest is gonna be there. So we thought of money, right? Yeah. Green, and like we went to a location. It was like a street, and then we seen a lady with a green shirt. Yeah, black lady with a green shirt. And she was like walking towards us, but Fritz said he he didn't see her in the dash I, cam. I, I really didn't see her in the dash cam at all. That's that, that was crazy. Like that, she that, was that, like was rushing. Scary. Like it looked was, like she was coming towards us. Yeah, I was, was kind of scary. Yeah, I was. That was scary. I, yeah, nah, I'm not that, doing bro. that no more. But the the last thing, this one actually creeps me out. So you know, no one knows who named Earth. Hmm. Like, there's nobody who knows. Like, there's no person that named Earth. Really? Yeah, I looked it up on Google. Like, who named Earth? It says the person who named Earth is unknown. Okay, but then who named all the other? That's what Planet. I'm saying. Like, it makes no sense. <laughs> like, it, like how, how do like it's like how do you not know who named it if you got all these other things like you put in documents and shit like that? You got every every document, everything documented. You don't know who named Earth. Earth. It wasn't Aristotle, or whatever his name was. It, it's not in the one Bible. Of those philosophers. It's not one of those philosophers that look in the stars and shit. Like they named Orion's belt, but they didn't name Earth. Hmm. <laughs> you think Earth was already named Earth as soon as like, like who? Yeah, who came up with Earth? Maybe like whoever. Maybe like genetically, like we're just known. We're just like genetically. Is it, is it like one of those things where you know, like you never know those those not even that like like those curses, like you know those words are bad words in this and the third, but you don't know why they're bad words. Probably. So is it? Like something like that, something like that. Like you just automatically know, like this is Earth. What? Like we're living in Earth. I First mean, of all, how you come up with Earth? Like that's. Uh, that's <laughs> but anyways, but what, just, what I'm thinking is, here's the 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 weird side, the conspiracy side of me. So, so there's a difference between like you know cavemen, yeah, and us. Like there's like a like scientists cannot prove to uh, like to the, uh scientists can't prove to this day how our DNA came from cavemen because like they're two different strands like we have 46 chromosomes i think they had 48 oh for real Damn. yeah so like homo sa- i think we're called homo sapiens they're called like something else so like no but it's it looks like something like really just like took their dna and took something else and just created us like our dna was like built and in the bible it says like you know man is like a mirror image of me like it says something like that in the bible I guess. Mm-hmm. And they're thinking that it's like that's like a sign that somebody or something like we were made as a mirror image of whoever whoever, whoever that, that is. is yeah. And like we're like a mirror image of them mixed with like the caveman people and like we're just like like um genetically like built to like know all this stuff. Like no words. Like that's how the words came about. Like maybe like they just genetically made us and like in our minds we just know this is earth. We live on earth. We live to, to um, to grow, repopulate, to survive, and to just evolve over time. Like you know, learn as much as we can until we die. I don't know. That's kind of sick. But you said that's your. That's what you. That's what. That's you what think? I. That's what I just thought of. Because like know. nobody, like how you not know who just named it and you just go along with it. That's like me like renaming something and like everybody in the world just goes along with it, but like they don't know it's me. 
Like, there's no way. Like, that makes so no sense. So, you sure you looked it up and no way? Look, like, look it up it's right not now. There. Like, who named Earth? I looked this up. I was like, no way. Literally said no one. Who named our planet? What does it say? The Greeks and Romans named most of, a, of the planets in the solar system after particular gods. So, what's what uh, god so is named anyway, Earth? You're, you're in his, uh, who named Earth? There we go. Who named Earth? Hold on. Who was it? They talk about like they talk about like who named who named Earth? That's they did not tell me nothing. It says it literally says the answer is we don't know. Look, no way. We don't know. <laughs> if you look up who, people, if you look up who named Earth, it says literally the answer is we don't know. The ner- the name Earth is derived from both from, English oh, and German okay. words. It's not even English. It's oh, happening. That's crazy. Like, how the hell? Hey, man. I'm just saying. I don't know who named Earth, but I'll take full responsibility. So, <laughs> so all of our, all of, all of the other planets are named from Greek and Roman goddesses and mm-hmm. gods. Yes. But ours is, is not- German. <laughs> half German, half English somehow. Deadass. Hey, man. This is it's nah. Probably, it is some crazy shit. It's weird, bro. But what? anyway, that goes in along with what I'm talking about, bro. Because hey, people, I got a good conspiracy to talk about. Because it kind of made me think about it a little bit. So I think you, you looked at the sheet, right? So what I want to. So what the thing is is like I feel like our conscious mind is more powerful than we like we can ever like imagine. Yeah. So let me tell you why. So so. There was a story, right, back in the 1920s, I think it was, like, in Germany, a guy named Paul, which is, his name's Paul, mm-hmm. I don't know what his last name was, so a guy named Paul had, like, a condition where, like, he would go to sleep a lot, and, like, he would, like, sleep for, like, days in and days out, and one time, he went, he actually went into a coma for a year, mm-hmm. but after he got out that coma, he said that he went to, like, a whole, he went to the future, and was in somebody else's body, and, like, he told a story, like, he wrote a book about it. And, like, they translated from, like, uh, Greek. It was either Greek or German. Greek or German to English. And it said that he learned about, like, like the their world in the future is, like, more advanced than us. Like, people don't have to work no more. There's, like, people that live on Mars. There was, like, a big-ass um, natural disa- disaster on Mars that wiped out everybody that lived there. But, like, they're starting to rebuild it now. Mm-hmm. They talk about technology, new technologies they have there. Because, like, he's in the 1920s. And he's talking about TVs and cell phones. Yeah. TVs and cell phones weren't made yeah. till like the TV was made probably like in the forties. Mm-hmm. And like nobody had a cell phone till like no the nineties. Yeah. So it's like how does like you it, it sounds stuff. like BS, but like how did he How did he predict all that? How did he predict all that, right? That's very true. So like oh, by the way, I got this from uh I got this from like a podcast I listened to. Uh Theories of the Third Kind. That shit was tough. Shout out to them niggas. Shout out. But um Yeah, so it made me think, right? So he was in a coma and he supposedly lived in another person's body. For like a couple, I think it was like a couple weeks, mm-hmm. or I think it was, I forgot how long it was. And he had people, he was asking questions like, what's going on, and this, that, and third. And like their whole society just like, they like, it's like world peace. Like they all made agreements, like there's no more wars, and we're all just gonna live in peace, and just like nobody has to work no more. Like you work two years, like once you graduate high school, and then you don't have to work no more. Why? Wow, that's really specific. Like, exactly. That's like he said, specific. like they everybody graduates at eighteen, seventeen. They work till they're like twenty, and then once they're done, they could just live their life. Like they just they all have a, a specific job they get assigned to. Mm-hmm. Like uh. I think it's like a, it was like a movie. It's like that. It's called Divergent, some shit like that. Mm-hmm. So they get a, spe- a specific job and they work that job for two years and then they go to, um, then once they work that job, then you could just live your life. And there's people that live on Mars, but it's like, I don't think Mars exploration didn't start to like the sixties and he's in the twenties talking about people living on Mars and like nobody ever thought about that. Yeah. So that made me think cause the, they was also talking about other people's experiences when they were in comas. Yeah. So like, a person was in a coma because he got hit by a car, right? Yeah. And like he was in a coma for probably like a year. Was a year, right? No, no, this is a whole another person. Oh, another. Yeah, person. it's like oh. just random because you know people go in comas and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So he was in a coma for about I think it wasn't like he didn't have major. I think it was like I'm gonna say, don't quote me. I'll say like a week, mm-hmm. but he lived a life that spanned over ten years really? in that coma. Like he told, like he woke up, he was like. 
he thought he had a, a wife, a daughter. Like when he woke up, he the people asked him like, "Oh, where um where were you going? Do you remember?" He was like, "Yeah, I went to go to my wife who was having twins." And like he had the names of each twin. He was like, "Yeah." And like he told he was like, "Yeah, I work for like a uh, the CIA in Great Britain or something like that." And like I have a private plane. And like the whole time like the people was like, "That's not your life." Oh, that was but just... he lived a, a whole nother life in in a matter of a week. And he remembers it all. And he swears that that's his life. But he don't, like, know. And another one, a little girl, had it went to a coma. Because, like, she, I think she almost drowned or something like that. So mm-hmm. she had, like, a medically induced coma for, like, a day or two. Mm-hmm. And, like, she she told her parents that she had dinner with her grandparents. Like, they was playing, like, swimming mermaids with her grandparents. And she never met her grandparents before. But, like, this makes me think, right? So, like, <clears throat> so our conscious minds, right? When we, so, like, you know when we dream... Yeah. Like, it's like we're unconscious for a little bit. Mm-hmm. So, like, I feel like when we dream, like, what if, like, our minds, our minds go somewhere else? Yeah. And then when we wake up, we come back. Mm-hmm. But, like, people in comas, like, what if, since they're in there for so long and unconscious for so long, they could go into other people's minds and just, like, live a whole nother life and they'll just never know about it. And it just makes me think, like, right now, like, what if that's happening to us right now? Oh, shit, there is. <laughs> like, think about it. Like... Like, oh, your conscious could just go into the universe and just find different worlds. You go into the world, and you're just living there. And, like, like even though, like, I've been alive for, like, 20, 22 years, like, it might have been just 10 minutes of me in a coma, and I just wake up. Like, you know how there's, like, a theory, like, when you die, you wake up, and it's, like, like, they said, uh, like, what if, like, when you die, you wake up, and it's, like, somebody takes a headset off of you and be like, oh, how was your life? It's like you come oh, like the Matrix. Yeah, like the yeah, like the Matrix. Like it's like you wake up and it's just like, damn, that wasn't my life. Like, what if you like wake up the next day and it's, it's like a whole nother life, and it was just all like a big dream. Oh shit! Oh shit! This nigga fucked my head up. That shit is okay. scary, bro. Okay, okay, but wouldn't like wouldn't when you're like when they were, when those guys were unconscious or you know when they were living other people's lives mm-hmm. weren't their lives better than the lives that they're having now i mean like they had like did that guy have like a wife and kids and shit like that like i think he had twins? a i think he had a wife but like i don't think he had kids but like he just like like assumed like that whole life he lived was just like real okay so he he just forgot about his regular life, like I guess he his, just maybe he just knocked him out that hard. <laughs> he just got knocked out. He yeah, just, you know, he, a, yeah, he did get fucked up by a car, right? Yeah, because like your mind is really like way stronger than like you could ever imagine. Oh no, yeah, yeah. like you know how people can control their dreams. Yeah, I forgot I had something I was gonna talk about. Lucid dreams. I, I remember I, I tried to have. Yeah, I tried. I tried, to I tried for like a like a weekend. I, I, can't I, I do got it. scared. I can't do it. I kept getting scared because I, like, I, I heard. I heard if you realize that you're dreaming that's when you could have your lucid dreams mm-hmm. like like you um you're dreaming and then you know some shit happens or some shit and, and then you're like oh that's like a red ball or something like that yeah, and something. you're like oh shit what what's going on like i'm mm-hmm. i'm supposed to be sleeping right now that's then that's when you start controlling your dreams i can I never do that i'd be, I, I be I forgetting yeah i'd be <laughs> I swear I'd be forgetting. I swear bro. I'd be forgetting too, bro. Like I'd be like going to my I'm like, damn, I thought that was like but like your dreams be feeling mad real. It's so real. So like what if like when you're in a coma, like like what if we're in a coma right now, bro? And it feels so real. We'll never know. Yo, that's crazy. Because uh, nah Damn, that's crazy. But I don't think so though. I don't think so either, but it's just that's just messes that, that, my head that, up. Bro. Yeah, that does mess your head up because it's like it's just crazy. Because like when you really actually dream yourself, like when when you go to sleep and dream, bro. Like niggas be waking up like crying. That's how real that shit be feeling. Mm-hmm. Like you ever you you ever like when you were a kid, like or whatever. Yeah. You just you had this like it could be like I had I used to have it when I was a kid. I remember I had a dream when I was like in preschool that like I was with my parents and like we got we like we got like you ever watched um Magic School Bus? Yeah. So like I was like I hopped in I hopped in a book when, and I seen like my new parents and like I had to leave them and it was like we're never gonna see you again. And I hopped out the book, I woke up, I started crying. <laughs> Wait, your new parents? Yeah, it was like but it was my parents from like now. Oh, for real? Yeah. So it was like I thought I never was gonna see my parents again. Oh okay. I, I woke up crying. Bro. Yeah, that's how that's how it cried be, the like, whole day. Yeah. The whole day, you I was pussy. So st- but anyways, <laughs> <What>? <laughs> 
Nigga, so they they just got ruined off of a dream I was anyway. Like five. <laughs> <laughs> you can make nah, a you pussy. <laughs> nah, but yeah. yeah, so I think yeah, I, I don't know about like I don't think I don't think about like that shit. Though. I know. I think it, it, it scares me. Yeah. Like I also thought, like, what if now, he, it is crazy that he lived a whole life as, in a uh, coma, in a coma, in a coma, <clears throat> a ten years. Like, like that's 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 crazy. And that guy, um, what year did he? The other guy, Paul. Yeah. He, I think he um, woke up in like uh, thirty nine oh six. Yeah, uh, something AD like that. Or something like that. Thirty nine. It was like year three thousand or year yeah, twenty nine. So it it was like it was like way farther. It was in the future, mm-hmm. way in the future. So it, and I, people think he's like faking it, but it's like it's so detailed. Like it's so detailed. If y'all read the book, I never read the book, but like if you read the book, like he was actually describing a lot of like things we have now, like phones, laptops, TVs. Mm-hmm. But it's like he never knew what that was. Mm-hmm. So like, so you, how can you possibly even predict something like that? That's what I'm like saying. That? But low key though, low key, there's a lot of people. I feel like in the 1900s or whatever. Yeah. I feel like they they were they they were saying shit like that back in the day. To be honest. What do you mean? Like they they were predicting flying cars, shit like that. Like, I mean, yeah, I think like so. Like since forever. I feel like they were too, but like, I feel like that's just like something like they had cars, so it was just like that's yeah, like the so next step. That's the next step. Yeah, but you can't predict the cell phone yeah. and shit like that. Like, like nobody thought of like a a a TV screen like with a like um like uh entertainment on TV. Yeah, yeah. Like nobody could predict that. Yeah. But and like it also made me think. So like uh, this this is what actually scared me. So like imagine when you die, right? Like what if like. It's just your body just dies, but your conscience your con- is still there, and like eyes closed, you can hear all this stuff, and you're just like you're still you're just trapped in your own oh that would body suck bro for the rest of your, like like eternity type shit that would suck because like there was a, I seen I heard about another dude he freaking he was in like a coma, but like he was just trapped in his own mind like he could hear he could hear everything, and he just can't say nothing really for twenty years. 20 years? He was trapped. He was in a coma? Yeah, he was trapped in a coma for 20 years. He couldn't move. Like No, he was paralyzed. Okay. But he couldn't speak. So he was just a vegetable. Yeah, he was just a vegetable, but he could hear everything. And he was just like, he had to like, he learned to like meditate just to relax himself. Because like, he was just be like, like screaming in his head because nobody, he can't speak. Yo. And like people that... be, people be like sitting around him, like talking to him and like crying. And he just wants to talk to him, but he physically can't Yo, do it. Yo, that sucks, bro. Exactly. Because I that's like that's like having um shit sleep paralysis. Mm-hmm. I had that the other day. You did? Yeah, like I had sleep paralysis. I was like I was sleeping, and I felt like I felt my body. I thought I died. Mm-hmm. I felt my body lift up off the off the bed, and really? like my body was still on the bed. Really? Yeah. I had I probably like um that experience once. Like I remember I lived back in like in Irvington. Yeah. And I was you know sleeping. I feel like I was. I, I I was sleeping, mm-hmm. but then, for some reason, I woke up. But it was a dream. I I be, I'm looking at my mom sleep. Like I'm looking at her sleep. Like she she's oh, sleeping nah, and shit. Hell no, bro. And I'm trying to speak. I couldn't say nothing. That's just I couldn't crazy. Say nothing. Bro. It's crazy. So when you die, like that that theory about when you die and you live, you know, you, your conscience is. It's just trapped. It's just trapped. That sucks. Like, cause nobody because nobody never like, knows. Bro, like, but what if they know that's what happens when you die? But like, they're not gonna tell you because they're just gonna be scared. And it's crazy because you're gonna be in a conscious. You're gonna be in a co- uh, coffin, coffin for the rest of. So you. you're just gonna be like. Like that's what it's maybe just that's pure why. Silence. Like what if oh what if like like people are haunted? It's just like they're just consciousness that escaped the bodies. Oh. And they're just like roaming around and they just they're just lost, literally lost souls. Oh shit. That's creepy. Damn, I just scared nah, myself. Nah, nah, that is creepy, bro. <laughs> she I really yo, that that is the, such such a huge mystery though. Nobody because ever because it out. unless they figure it out, they just don't want to tell us cuz that's bad. Nah, yeah, that's a, yeah. But that that's such a big mystery because it's like there's so many there's so many like theories about what happened when after in the afterlife, yeah, like there's a lot of people who've died and came back mm-hmm. and talked about, oh, I seen the devil. I feel oh, like those people God. are just like very spiritual people. Yeah, I feel like you see what you want to believe. Mm. 
That's true. I feel like like some people don't believe in God. You're not going to see him. Mm. If you believe in reincarnation, you nope. reincarnate. Wait, hold on. Because there are some people that said that they never believed in God and shit, like atheists or whatever. Yeah. They said that they seen him and that they changed their lives. Are you serious? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, but but that that is a good... That was a good uh, could statement, be. though. You never but, know. Yeah. Like... And like there's a there was another theory that's been going around I've been seeing on TikTok. And wait, 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 one more question. What? Would you have that like your consciousness that trapped trapped or go to hell? Bring me to hell, bro. <laughs> Bring me to hell. <laughs> you going to hell? I'm bro. going to hell, bro. The devil gonna have to chase me around that bit. <laughs> I I'm not being trapped. At least no cap. <laughs> I, I would definitely go to hell in a heartbeat. For real? Hell yeah. I'm not going to be trapped in my body in a coffin just sitting there for the rest of eternity. Yeah, but you're going to get tortured for the rest of eternity. Hey, bro. <gasps> T- I'm tortured with my niggas. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> we all good. Don't bring me around here. <laughs> no, bro. Well, you going to be trapped in that box? I think I might. Hell no. Like, I'm gonna be, right, if I'm, if gonna I can be, if I'm trapped in that box and I'll be able to like escape and haunt people, I'll do that. Nah, okay. you're gonna be trapped in a Hell box. Hell no, nigga. Get think about it. You could just stay there. Listen. Well, to I'm me. just gonna be Listen, on fire like, for think, the rest of my life what? for eternity if what I'm you? in hell, bro. Yeah, I think you get. Yeah. Hey, bro. Like people some, talk some about people they got I know might be going down there. Yeah. Hey, there's a few people I know that we gonna, might be going. We down gonna there. hide from the devil. But not me. me. But not me. We gonna hey, jump. Yeah, him. I'm, I'm gonna be in that coffin. Uh, singing music or some shit Like singing a song or some shit For the rest of your turn What song you gonna sing for the rest of your life For the rest of your turn What the fuck are you gonna sing <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna rap the Chef G album <laughs> Yo rapping rap, Chef G <laughs> For eternity is crazy <laughs> I'm gonna rap I'm gonna, I don't know Don't run no trip <laughs> For the rest of eternity, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Just rap, talk, facts about me, <laughs> hey, CJ, you see me, I ain't see you. <laughs> I'm just rapping. Yo, I'm nah, I'm just rapping for bro. the rest of eternity, bro. Nah, bro. I'm oh. not rapping for the rest of eternity. I'm going to hell, bro. I'm sorry, God. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's a horrible punishment, bro. That is a horrible punishment. Yeah, that would suck, bro. Just imagine, like I'm. Nah, I'm going to hell, bro. <laughs> like me and me and the gang, we gonna. We just, nah, I'd go to hell too. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, bro, we gonna find a. It give might me be something fun. to do, you know. Might be fun. It might not. No, it's not <laughs> gonna be fun, bro. But give me something to do, bro. Like what the devil? Like we just gonna be slaves? Fuck it. All right, look, we just gonna be slaves to the devil, right? It don't mean we can't joke about shit. <laughs> like, hey, yo, Hitler, where you at? Come bring this shit over here, bro. I'm calling like, Hitler. Who else? Who else in hell right now? Hitler, Stalin, Stalin, El Stalin, bro. Uh, shit, um, who else? Who, who shot JFK? He died. Oh yeah. He, um. Oh, died. Died. Um. What's his name? Oswald. 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 What's Oswald. up, bro? Oswald was good. Bin Laden. Man. Bin Laden. Nah, he good, might. Man. Bro, it's lit. <laughs> this nigga crazy. <laughs> keep it, keep me from around there, bro. Fuck that, bro. Like I'm Hitler, I would be. <laughs> this nigga there is gonna be chilling with Hitler, chilling <laughs> with chilling, <laughs> chilling with Stalin. Hey, bro, they gonna find Bin Laden. Bro. Hey, man, <laughs> this nigga Jeez. funny as hell. Hey, Tupac might be down there. Hell no, my nigga up there, bro. My nigga Tupac up there, bro. Hey, bro, he, Shit, he might be down there after what's been going around. What you mean, bro? <laughs> J- bro? You seen that video about what? With uh, that Jada, that Jada, um, that got released. Is it new? Like it just came out today? Nah, it, well, it was back in the day, but it was. Um, Is it like when uh, she she said she didn't want to be married to Will or something like that? Yeah, that's some bullshit. That's fucked up too. I hate her, y'all. I I really don't like Jada. I feel, I feel bad for Will, man. No, nah, I really that's a damn shame. I really hate that woman. Because why are you, why are you, first of all, that nigga's down already. Down tremendously. He, 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 he defending he's, you. He's, ba- he defending you. He's banned from the Oscars for 10 years. Really? Yes, he's banned from the Oscars for 10 years. You After see? That. He's banned from the Oscars. So does that mean, can he be nominated? I doubt it. I don't think so. Damn, that sucks. For 10 years. <clears throat> so he's banned from the Oscars for defending you. Exactly. You, you, and then next thing you know, he's getting all this backlash. Mm-hmm. Then you say, I wish I didn't, uh, or I, I didn't want to get married to him. You serious? I feel bad the for him, The nigga down bad already. So you, you just, just be kicking him. You just cook, kicking 
the guy, bro. Kicking him while he down, bro. That's, that's a damn up. shame. That's fucked up. And that's the lady you've been here for what? How many? Like 20 some years, I yeah, guess. Yeah, like, just so divorce the guy. That's this the, is your fault. Yo, honestly, but. You could have told him no. That's your dumbass but fault. But it's like. You don't want to be a baby will, mama. That's your fault. Will, though. I just, I'm like telling he, you, I think he like, he's, she's jealous of him. I really believe she's jealous of that man. Really? Hell yeah. Why? Because I, you see how famous he is, bro. Like yeah. Will Smith is on the top of the tops of like actors. Of the actors, yeah. And like she, you don't see Jada all no she more. is in, in black sitcoms. Yeah, she 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 used to be it. Yeah, but now she's she not, not. It no more. She not it no more. But he's still up there. He's still up there. And he be doing all this stuff, enjoying his life. Mm-hmm. And now she's like, nah, I gotta even it out. Mm-hmm. I hate him. Boy, that's just hating true. on him, bro. Like just, I hate it, bro. That's like, true. I really feel uh, bad. Yeah, I feel bad. So that's but that's what I'm saying though. Sick, bro. Will gotta get grow some balls. And leave her. Yeah, you can just leave her now, bro. Your kid's old enough. You don't got to do nothing. Yeah, but the thing is, I feel like Will is one of those guys who just afraid of being alone. He's been with the girl, the girl for 20 plus years. <sighs> who else is he going to be with? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I guess. But at, 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 a, at a point where it just seemed everybody, the world is looking at you like you soft. <clears throat> yeah. And like maybe 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 this is all a lie, and it's just this is just like that, they're lying be, about it. That would be crazy. That would be so crazy. Like, and they're, they're all chilling that? at home, yeah. type shit. But I don't know. I don't know, bro. Free Will Smith till his back. Nah, free bro. free Will Smith, bro. Man, but, oh, I got the the theory I want to talk about was somebody sent it to me on TikTok. Shout out to you, bro. If y'all want to send me some theories, we'll talk about it. We'll react to it. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't think this is true, but it. It kind of goes in with what I was talking about with the conscious thing. Yeah. So, like, there's a theory that everybody died, that everybody in this world is dead right now. Oh, bro. You heard about that, right? No. All right. <laughs> so, so everybody in this world is dead, right? So, you know, back in 2012, the world was going to end. So, yeah. supposedly, it did end, and we're all dead. But the reason why we're still like this is because, like, you know how your life flashes before your eyes? Yeah. So, that... Supposedly, there's a fact that it, that does happen. So, like, it's yeah, seven, yeah, I know, I know seven to eight minutes where you're just watching your life. Okay. But in that conscious period, like, time doesn't exist. So, it could be seven to eight minutes out on the outside. But in your mind, it could be, like I said before, years. years. So, like, what if we're just living those years right no, now? No, bro. I don't believe that. That's kind of no, nuts, bro. bro. That's crazy. That's really but nuts. no, bro. I don't know, bro. Because wouldn't you... Like I can't, no, I, I, I feel like I wouldn't be able to. Like I can't touch you. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Like we're 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 you know yeah. we're physically pause way. Right? We're physically hell? like touching each other like pause though. But like you know we're you know yeah like know we're, we're, we're we know what's going on like we're you feel but me? like but like think about it again like what if your mind is really that strong? That's nuts. No, bro. I don't know. No, bro. but. The thing in 2012, bro, didn't they make a movie about that? Yeah. Wouldn't we, like... Realize it? Realize it. But, like, just like how we're in dreams, we never realize we're in dreams. Oh, yeah, that's true. Like, that could be the same thing. Nah, bro. That's crazy, though. Nah. I don't know. I'm not doing... No, I'm not buying it. I don't, I'm not buying it either, but it's it's, it's pretty... It's a mind fuck. I ain't gonna lie. So I, y'all people sick, man. <laughs> nah, you guys are sick. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> we all died. You hey, serious? Hey, hey. Span of years. Anyways, but wouldn't be like, like you remember when you was talking about like it was like a span of ten years? Mm-hmm. How can it pos- like there's people who live for hundreds. hundreds? I mean, it is your whole life flashing before your eyes, literally. So you probably oh. just live your life and then you just. Damn. I don't know. Nah. <laughs> I don't know I don't know man I just feel like It's just like So is that like When you die So it's like We're Alright so we Our life is flashing Before our eyes right now And then when we die It's like Are we just gonna restart it Aren't we technically gonna restart Is it just like Continuously like restart Yeah like a cycle Or some shit Like no Maybe Nah Like what if Like what if you die And you just restart Restart what Your life The same life I mean, it's just like a, it's it's like, yeah, that same exact life you had, like you just die and then you wake up in the hospital as it's you again, but you're a baby. You just keep it's like a cycle. But wouldn't wouldn't okay so but so like wouldn't the same thing so the same thing's gonna keep happening to something like that? Yeah, I guess that's why we have deja vu. So wouldn't wouldn't you you wouldn't realize it? 
I mean, isn't that what deja vu is? Like you have maybe we'll have little dreams of little instances, be like, oh, I seen that before. I don't know where. Oh shit. <laughs> I don't know. Nah. I don't think so. I don't know. Ah, that scares I, like, me. Like like I said, bro. I feel like my theory about dying is yeah. When we die, I'm gonna be a white white guy <laughs> next next wow. in the next life, or or a white woman in the next life, or another black dude. You know, <laughs> might be a basketball player, might be a football player. You just get reincarnate. What if I'm you're an animal? Reincar- that would suck. Bro. <laughs> nah, I, I don't think so. I feel like animals get reincarnated into as animals. animals. Okay. Nah, so I, then I think there could be animals. I feel like there's gonna there's gonna be one lucky animal that turns into a human being. And he's just a little 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 slow. <laughs> <laughs> there's no way this thing is wilding right now. <laughs> Dude, I'm kidding, bro. Me. How slow? How, that's the slowest you could get, bro. <laughs> Yo, that's a ant. You got it. <laughs> that that is crazy. <laughs> oh my god, bro. That's a funny. That's shit. wild. <laughs> like, what about what about fruits? Fruits are the shit. There's no souls. They ain't got no souls. I know, but aren't they like trees and plants? Aren't they? Oh, living they are thing? living things. Damn! Imagine Come on, a tree. Oh, I'll be mad as hell if I get put into a tree. Imagine, bro. Trees live for like four hundred years. But, but yeah, but trees, trees aren't like they got no like conscious. You don't know that. It might be. I mean, shit. It might be the world. The world is like a, a organism. That is true. So uh, trees are living things. So how do they like? Shit, like. You know they'd be saying trees talking shit. Yeah, they communicate with with with, with uh, like plants do be complete communicate. Yeah, with I each guess, other. but I don't know. Scary, bro. Scary world that we live in. People, you never like. There's so many. There's probably so much. So many things in this world that we will never be able to understand, like to comprehend. That just happens. You think that? You think that we will, like, eventually learn these things? Uh, I think over time. I don't think like we're we're not gonna be alive by then. Maybe one thing. I hope one one new discovery come um, uh, comes out. Like what year do you think? I'll say twenty. What year do you think that shit's gonna? Oh, like, like there's gonna be some shit that just oh oh like something up. big. Yes, I'll say year two thousand forty. Nah, I say twenty fifty. Twenty fifty. Twenty fifty is a good year. I'll be how old are we gonna be? I'll be fifty one. But we'll be fifty. Wow, we're gonna be pretty young at yeah, twenty fifty. Yeah, we're straight. Alien might come through. Oh shit! Imagine the world at twenty fifty, guys. I don't know, people. What do you think the world gonna be at twenty fifty? That should probably be lit. We already got. Uh, I see. Uh, we already have electric cars. Mm-hmm. Freaking Nissan! I heard was making an electric car by two thousand twenty eight. The hell? I, who cares? I, I, who cares? <laughs> like what? Yeah, like you late got, as hell? Yeah, you, you got Teslas <laughs> and shit. Man. Like why does it take you another an extra six years yeah, to make well, an electric car? Nissan. Like, what the <laughs> like fuck? okay, the, nobody going to drive. It better no be. Way. It better be affordable though. I'm not gonna lie. Like, oh yeah, it should shit. be. I feel like all cars would be. Nah, I think I don't think that'd be possible. I talked about it last episode. I don't think it'll be possible for every car to be electric. Yeah, because nah. the oil companies are too strong and powerful. Yeah, they're that's kill true. Us all. They, they, yeah, they're not gonna. They're not gonna let that happen. There has to be. Money coming in. Hell yeah, that. you know I be, you know I be. Yeah. All right, so um, all right, so since we talking about that, right? So imagine the animals from prehistoric times, right? Imagine they switched with our animals, bro. How you think, like dinosaurs? I'm on, I, I've been how you think? Do you think we'll? You think we'll live? No. <sighs> I'm living. We're not bro. living. I'm living. We're not living. I am conquering them dinosaurs. No, you, no you're not. I I love I'm, the confidence. I love it. <laughs> I really do, but it's just not happening. It's really not. There's T Rex, bro. There's a T Rex, bro. A Brontosaurus, whatever them shits are called. Yeah. Ra- um, um, Rhinosaurus. Tricer- tri- Tric- uh, wait. <laughs> Triceratops? Triceratops, whatever. Yeah, I think a rhinos- a rhinosaurus. There was a rhinosaurus. There was right? no damn rhinosaurus. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> but whatever, bro. <laughs> rhinoceros. There it is. There is a rhinoceros. There is a rhinoceros. A rhinoceros. Caught, caught your dumb ass. A yeah. rhinoceros is a rhino. Really? Yes. <laughs> no way. He just said that. Okay. With boom. confidence. Cut that shit out. <laughs> Cut that shit out. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Back to what I was saying. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, T-Rex. Uh-huh. Comes to your crib. You're done. Nah, bro, I'm good. What you doing with that? I'm cool. You know, they're meat eaters, right? 
Hey, yo. Pause. Hey, yo. <laughs> you know they're carnivores, right? I, bro, they, I heard T Rexes was like big birds. Like they, they, there's a proven fact that they have they have uh, feathers now. So they're not that they don't look that scary no more. There's they don't look that scary. Man, that's because they're like, big. Right. Yo, they're 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 how many feet tall? Okay, look, it's not like so. Think think about it now, right? There's there's bears. There's like uh. There's bears, there's lions. They don't just be running around the the place. We're gonna figure out a way to like keep them in like a certain area. Like, you, know, just you know, you know, you know, dinosaurs like ruled the world, right? Bro, we gonna rule the world. Yeah, but dinosaurs. Yeah, but they ain't right. gonna run. The only thing we should be afraid of is like the people in the water. And there's um uh oh the pterodactyls. pterodactyls. Oh damn, I ain't gonna lie. Them pterodactyls is on your ass. Those those are birds. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Pterodactyls might like scoop up a couple kids. We're done. <sighs> Bald eagle scoop the could, could, could scoop up kids. That bro. is true. Ah, pterodactyl damn. could scoop up a grown ass man. I feel like you know what? I feel like I'm gonna have a I'm gonna, I'm gonna have some type of prehistoric animal because you know prehistoric animals back in the days were they were huge. They were all big. Like the sloths were huge. Them jumps Mammoth. was like biggest. All right, you know what? I hey, feel like I'm gonna caught you. You know, I feel like I'm going to have a pet to protect me. Darius is just chatting right now. <laughs> you just want to live so bad. I Darius, do. we're going to die. We there's can survive, bro. There's literally we no way we're not going to, like, we can I survive. mean, I guess we got the, like, I guess the army and the firepower. And yeah, like, like, we like got, that. we got our brains. We can but figure there, out a way. But I think, I think they were actually, like, first of all, pterodactyls are crazy. They're, they're going to, like, they're faster, bro. They're, they're faster are, and they're going to swoop us up. They're going to swoop us up. God damn. I think, I don't know about the T-Rex. I don't know if they, I mean, the shit that I watched, they didn't look that fast. So, you feel me? I mean. So, I could, I could run away from you You're not running a T-Rex. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not. No, nah, you're not. It might be slow so. for you. I, I'll be, I'll be more afraid of the, 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 the pterodactyls and the raptors. The raptors are fast. Yeah, they're fast. They're fast. They might get me, catch me lacking. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Them niggas go. But like, what if we like, what if we like, all just like, like we just, they're not just hunting us. There might be a couple that tries to hunt us down. But like, ah, oh, damn. What do you mean? They're carnivores. I know, but like, so are bears. But they don't try to kill us, unless we bother them. Like, what if they? What if dinosaurs just freaking like bother? Like, if they, we bother, they, them, if we then bother we'll, them, then we'll then, then they'll kill they, us. They're on their ass. Nah, I think there are dinosaurs are like whatever we see, whatever they see, they they gonna eat. Bro. You think so, nigga? You talked about having a pet. What pet's gonna protect your ass? <laughs> I don't know, bro. <laughs> like know. what? what Maybe pet? another pterodactyl. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> one pterodactyl is not gonna save you. I from feel like we're gonna be from, pretty from advanced from if we have that though. If we have dinosaurs, it'd be, it'd be tough. Yeah. Imagine instead of horses, we was riding raptors. That'd that's, be fire. That's tough, right? That'd be fire. But I don't want to go near that shit. <laughs> so no, I'm not, I wouldn't do that shit. The I way think, that they look. So you, so you think we're gonna die? I think we're dead. I think we'd be straight. You know me, but I'm optimism at the house. Yeah, at the you ass, just bro. you just want to look at the bright side for everything. I do. Lo- it's not that easy. It's not that easy. Uh, we're gonna like we're gonna we're gonna die. There's it's <sighs> it's it's okay though. Yeah yeah it's yeah. It's okay. Whatever. We're bro. good with the ones that we have, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm keeping the animals that we have, bro. Yeah, I feel you. You but feel me? That'd be tough to walk outside. You see a dinosaur. Like, think about it, bro. Like, instead of deers, they're just like those little things that run into each other. Like, they headbutt each other. That'd be fire. Oh, what are? I forgot what those are called. The, their names are too long. I don't know. I used to love dinosaurs. That's probably why I would live. Really? Yeah, I used to love dinosaurs when I was a kid. That's probably why you would live. So, so what the what that mean? Hey, I'm an expert. I like lions. <laughs> I'm dying if I see one in front of me. What the fuck? Hey, bro. You know, I mean, man. fucked up, bro. Damn, man. Like you're crazy. Right. I'm going to die. We'll see, bro. But I got another segment that we're going to talk about, bro. It's a superhero team fight. So we got the nice. Avengers versus the Justice League. <coughs> All right. So I have the top five Avengers versus the top five Justice League. And we're going to think. We're going to, like, debate, like, who's, who's going to win. Who's going to win. Yeah. All right. Before we start, like, what do you like but more? Event, the Marvel or DC? Guy. All right. Respect. I'm a DC. Guy. I'm a DC. Nigga but the thing now, is, bro. though, I really, I really. Started, I like the Marvel movies. Yeah, I like the Marvel movies, and I really started like, really fucking with. I was like, yo, these Marvel niggas. Yeah, it's, they 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 tough. But I I still like feel like DC. But we're, we're, I'm trying to be unbiased. We're just gonna go how we go. Yeah. So first, it's the Hulk versus Wonder Woman. That's such a good matchup. That is a good matchup. 
I feel like I feel like I feel like it has to be Wonder Woman. I feel like that too because because Wonder Woman is just like a downgraded version of Superman. That's a fact. And um not to be sexist people, don't come at me. Relax. Yeah, not to be sexist. It's just a fa- it's just if niggas get get <laughs> offended off of that, don't don't know that. Hey, because man. first of all, <clears throat> Hulk could turn to Bruce Banner. Exactly. So he- so that's his that's a disadvantage of, on that. Uh-huh. And you know, Wonder Woman got you know that shield that that strong. Like it's, I think it's on the lasso. The lasso. She can also she got, got the, the lasso little and the uh, little gauntlets. Her. Yeah, uh, <coughs> I think, and she's still one of the like the strongest. strongest. Yeah, the like, Justice she League. Probably, she probably like second to Superman. Either, either her or Batman. Batman brains. Batman brain really. Dang, I'm her. talking about strength. Oh yeah. It's she's yeah she's a second. If it if it was if if it's with brains, bro. I think Batman's in DC. Batman's like the best. Superhero. Yeah, I think he's the smartest. But mm-hmm. I think Wonder Woman got Hulk over Hulk. Yeah, I yeah. think so too. Because I in in all actuality, like yeah, Hulk, Hulk, mm-hmm. Hulk. All right, the next one is Iron Man versus Green Lantern. Green Lantern is very underrated. He I is thought, underrated. I used to think he was ass. Me too. But that ring could do a it's lot. Hard. It's tough. It could do a lot of damage. Um. Iron Man versus Green Lantern. But I feel like Iron Man is like, he's smart enough to catch him lacking. Because Green Lantern, lacking. very, he got an ego. He think he could kill anybody. But when Doomsday came around, he got he his got ass, ass whooped. whooped. <laughs> he got his ass whooped. <laughs> um, I don't know. I want to take Iron Man for this one. I do. Then again, Iron Man is... Just a guy in a suit. That's what I'm saying. But like, he can make something for Green Lantern. I feel like he's like, he can. He's like Batman, but like not as he's not as smart. Not as smart as Batman. I don't think he's that smart as Batman. No, hell no. But I think I'll I'll give a slight edge to Iron Man. I I will uh, just because of his smarts. I'll I'll give him that too. But I feel like then again, but then again, he's like. It's a it's a, it's a it's a battle like offer. So I don't think they know each other. Uh-huh. They don't know each other. They're they're different. You know uh, universes. universes. Yeah. So it's like, how can Green? How can Iron Man make a suit for Green Lantern if he mm-hmm. don't even know that shit? If yeah. He if he know. doesn't know like his power come from that yeah, ring. Exactly. But I feel like he'll he'll like realize it. Yeah. And then he'll try to get the ring off and then just capture him type shit. Okay. A- unless Green Lantern like beats his ass, like knocks him out the suit. That's the only way. That is that is, the but one. yeah, I, I'll give it a slight edge to. I give I give it Iron Man too. Iron Man. All right, so Spider Man versus the Flash. Spider Man's very underrated. Spider Man is my is my favorite uh, Marvel one. Like I be forgetting how strong he is. He's a strong dude. He's he's yeah he's really and with strong. this and with the suit is tough. Yeah, but I don't know the Flash, bro. Flash is cheese. It's a hit or miss though. It is a hit or miss because because Flash sometimes be doing ass. Uh huh. Be doing real ass, and and you know Flash is really one of my favorite DC characters mm-hmm. too because yeah. I I love the Flash, I love just the power of super speed in general. Yeah. So the fact that he be doing ass, I be I, I be wanting Flash to be like one of the best superheroes. I know, but he just be doing he ass. just be doing ass sometimes. Like when he's but the, going against Doomsday, he freaking got rocked. Yeah, how you get rocked? And the thing is, he's so smart. He's a scientist. Exactly. He doesn't use his head, bro. He don't. He just figure he run, just be, that, running. It'd be pissing me off. But. So, I think he still be Spider Man though. He can. Yeah, I think he can. Because I don't think. First of all, how is Spider Man gonna keep up with him? I don't know. Unless like he has his webs. He finds yeah, a way. I mean, I mean, he could find a way with his webs. But first of all, he could. Um, Flash could go to the speed. Go to like different speed like, force, yeah. Use a speed force. Go back in time, like go that. into the future type shit. But like, I'm I'm taking the flash. I think I'm trying. Yeah, I'm taking the flash. I'm taking the flash. I'm taking the flash. All right, Cap Captain America versus Batman. The Batman. battle between two Batman. normal guys. Batman. Batman is frying Batman. him. Batman. I'm sorry, bro. Batman I, is kicking Cap Captain America ass, bro. I, I I've been saying Captain America ass. I like, don't care what, what nobody say. I'm I'm starting to realize it. He's kind of ass. Hey, I've been saying that, bro. Like he just got a shield. That's it. Shield super strength. 
That's it. Not even super strength. He just it's, strong it's just as hell. Strong. He's, he's like, just strong. Strong than enough. The average just human. Human. Faster than the average human. He don't got like he just got and got combat skills. He Bat- just a, yeah yeah he that's it. Batman. He is Batman. Literally and Batman. he not even he not even fucking like he can Captain beat America Bat- is not even that smart. Like he's like Batman is literally in the DC universe is literally either the smartest or one of the, one smartest, of the smartest people. In the in, in the, the whole, whole universe. universe, it's crazy, bro. Like he could really take that anybody. He, so the fact that he could do that, and see, like think about it, Captain America versus Thor. Uh, well, Thor whooping Captain America ass. Uh huh. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. Thor yeah. whooping Captain America ass. Uh, Hulk whooping Captain America ass. Iron Man. I, Iron Man whoop, um, being Captain America. Spider Man being Captain America. Like all that. I don't care Captain what America, nobody he, says. He's mid. They could be throwing a shield. Okay. So what? Batman during the combat will find his weaknesses mm-hmm. and find ways to to kill him. To 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 kill him. It'll be Bat- so it's easy. Batman all the way, bro. It'll be it, so easy, it'll bro. It'll be so easy for Batman. Like Batman. Captain America biggest yo Bat- power is like uh motivation. That's it. <laughs> and leadership. <laughs> America. <laughs> like come on, bro. Like patriotism. If you if Captain America so your favorite I'm judging you. Yeah, bro. You're it's such a, it's so ass, bro. Hey, bro. There's Batman, so many other Batman, superheroes, bro. Batman goes through hell, bro. Exactly. Literally every Joker, day. Joker, Dark Side, fucking God. Anybody, bro. Freaking uh Doomsday. Doomsday. Could kicked his ass. Like, come on. Bane. Bane, yeah. That's no. basically Captain America. Exactly. He's strong as even Bane. I think Bane's stronger than Captain America. Hell bro, yeah. if, if Captain America was in the DC universe, he would die. Yeah, <laughs> he would die. Captain America is not keeping up. He'll be equivalent to Hawk, man. Yeah, <laughs> Captain America is not keeping up. He's not keeping up. Bro. There's literally, I think there's um some superheroes that's like Captain America in the DC. I forgot they're called uh Star Star something. I forgot they really? could they could fly, but they yeah. they, they ass yeah, they, they, they don't do nothing, bro. Yeah. And the, and the last one is the the Battle of the Titans, bro. It's Thor versus Superman. I love this one. Because Superman is my favorite, my favorite uh, DC hero. Oh, yeah. hero. Okay. And uh, Thor, I'm Thor. Yeah. So. What do you think, bro? <sighs> I'm not gonna lie. I don't think it's fair. For who? I think Superman whooping his ass. Really? Yeah, I think Superman whooping his ass. Really? Yeah. Unless Thor with the Got lightning. Got kryptonite. Yeah, kryptonite or he electrocutes him just like to buy him some time. But like other than that, I really don't think even though the electrocution is not gonna it's work, not gonna hurt work. He's just gonna get up and get even mad. Just go laser beam. I, yeah, Superman. Superman is the most overpowered superhero, superhero ever, ever, created. ever created. Like literally, literally ever. He only had the only weakness he has is that rock. Is that rock? That's the only which thing. really sucks. But I know. It's, it's like it's it, what he has to. It, 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 it has, has to, to be something. Exactly, it has to. But. I just think Thor, bro. Not only that, without uh his hammer, Mjolnir, uh, exactly. Thor, Thor's not keeping up. Neither. He's not keeping up, bro. I feel he, like he could break. Is that you, Jay? Yeah. Hey, answer, answer the phone. Yeah, see, see what he's going to say. What your ass want, bro? You live in effect. Yeah, bro. Yo. Yo, say, say what, say what, say, say what's good. Up. Yeah, yo, put him on the bike, put him on the bike. Tell him to say what's good. What's going on, you know what I'm saying? No regular podcast. We up, you know what I'm saying? 120,000, you know what I'm saying? Followers on the TikTok, you know what I'm saying? We're going up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. What? Yes, sir. Gang. Yes, sir. (laughs) All right, I'm going to talk to you guys. But, yeah, bro. I think Thor getting fried, bro. Yeah, Thor's getting fried. I think he's getting fried. Like, it's like really not fair. Like, these are the strong. This is it. That's it. (laughs) Like, low key. The what, team? About, wait, 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 what about I think Captain Marvel? Oh, fuck Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel getting her ass whipped too. You think so? By Superman. By, by Superman? Yeah. What's I think Ka- I think Captain Marvel is the strongest Avenger? I mean, but no, she's not in the Marvel. Marvel. Yeah, I was just no, picking Avengers. Right the Marvel. Oh, the Avengers. Oh, yeah. you said the Avengers. Yeah, yeah. But if yeah, we're nah, talking nah. DC then shit, we we'll pull out something out. But Yeah, because I don't know what her weakness is for her. Like, this like I think she's 
I don't think that she has a weakness. I, I doubt it. I feel like they just made her to like compete. Just with to Superman. compete. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Made her a woman. Yeah. But That's fair. Yeah. We're not going to say nothing. We're not going to say nothing. <laughs> hey, man. It's Sheesh. all right. It's whatever. But yeah, this I'm gonna do this for a couple episodes. I'm gonna do like different like Teen Titans one week. Teen Titans. I ain't go a lot. I think the Teen Titans could at least hold the it, hold, hold it down a little bit. With the Avengers? Yeah, just a little bit. They could hold it down a little you bit. You think so? With Cyborg, what Cyborg, Cyborg Beast, Boy, Beast Boy, Robin, Robin Raven, Raven, and Starfire. Starfire. I think they could hold it down a little bit. Shh. Oh, they got Hulk. Think cyborg is cy- cyborg is pretty smart. He'll figure out. Oh yeah, out cyborg away. cyborg one of the smartest in DC too. Okay, Hulk, Thor, those are the two big dogs. Then you got then you got if Raven got, releases the demon, it's over. I mean, but they all die. <laughs> yeah. If Raven releases the Tri, uh, Trigon, yeah. But I mean, Raven Raven is ro- like low key strong as hell, but she just don't know how to control that shit. Yeah, that's true. Starfire is mid mid. Beast Ass. Boy is high key is underrated. Beast Boy is really underrated. He could turn to anything. He can turn. To he could turn to Godzilla, yeah, and but, just stomp on Hulk. Yeah, but think about it though. I feel like those. I feel like Hulk is still stronger than. Godzilla. I know. I, I feel like they'll they'll like compete with them. But the thing about they're kids. Yeah, they are. And they're they could compete with the Avengers. Yeah, that's true. The, the Justice League is whooping their ass. Yeah, that's true. Like that's just, that's, that's terrible, bro. That's bad. That's true. That's true. That's true. Hey, bro. But I, but I feel like I, I, what about I, Iron Man? Uh, nah, that's true. I but, even say Aquaman. I even got. I mean, Aquaman mid. Aquaman's ass. Yeah. So, but, Aquaman. People, let me know what y'all think, man. Who y'all think? Avengers, Avengers, Avengers or, or, Justice, or League? Justice League? I think Justice League all the way. Yeah, Justice League all the way. Justice League all the way. No question. Justice League all the way. All right. Do I have a? Do I have any more? Would you? I think I have a would you rather question. Oh no! Actually, I have an, I have another question. We're talking about cartoons, right? So, so say right now, right? You get to pick what cartoon show you could be a part of as like a NPC. So like you can't go into Teen Titans and have a power, but you just like a normal human being in a TV show. What TV show would that be? A cartoon? If okay, let me let me rephrase that again. So if you had the choice to jump I'm into just a, a regular, nigga. yeah, you're a regular dude. If you had the choice to jump into a cartoon world. Any cartoon world of your choice, but you're just a regular person. What cartoon world would that be? Any cartoon that when you growing up, your favorite cartoon. Well, my favorite cartoon of all time is Hey Arnold. Mm. I don't want to be in that. <laughs> you're just going to be poor. <laughs> poor ass niggas. I don't want to be in that bitch. I, I'm going a, I'm to a leave that aside. <laughs> It'll be just a struggle. Like a struggle yeah. Orphan. <laughs> Yo, them niggas living it rough. That's why I like the show so much. Yeah. Because it's like real shit. Yeah, but, bro. They just. Um, what show? Damn, there is. Let me tell you mine. Yeah. I think, I, I think I'll go in like Eddie and Eddie. Nah. I'll be fire. Nah. I think that'll be fire. Why? Because, bro, it's just like, like they don't have no parents worrying about them. That's they true. get to do whatever they want, just getting money. Getting cents. Hey, bro, that sense is they like a lot. They got 25 cents for some jawbreakers. You going to try to help them get some jawbreakers? Yeah, bro. That shit would sound fire. Either Ed and Eddie or um, I would say, I would say, um, what's that show? Phineas and Ferb. Phineas and Ferb is a good one. Yeah, because like, they, they make a new invention every day and I get to just do it for free. Phineas, Fer- Phineas and Ferb is a good one. That's a tough, that's a good I one. I think I would say, I, I'd. Dang, Phineas and Ferb is a good one. Yeah, because like, just imagine they make a new invention every day. It's something yeah, and new. then you could just you know That'd use the adventures. Like that's tough. And they lived. They they live like they they were in summertime. Like, exactly, for, summertime for the, for damn near the, for the rest the of the whole day. series. Yeah, the whole series. I'm pick- I think I think I like Phineas and Ferb, but I want to choose something else. I want to choose something else. I just don't know what. I want to choose something else. Let me think let me choose something, something else. Let me think of some other TV shows. Let's see. Let me look it up. Dexter's Lab. We got oh. SpongeBob. I don't want no SpongeBob. I don't know. Let's see. Like what? Like what? A I'm telling. I'm getting money. Me and Ed. Me and Ed's. We getting money. Bro, <laughs> you just like it because that's your favorite show. Bro. It's one of my favorites. Uh. Uh. Rugrats. Hell no! I don't want to be no baby. Yeah, no. Nah, I'm cool. Fairly Odd Parents. 
Ooh. But like, I would have to be a bad a, like, I would have to be like a kid. You had to be like a struggling kid to get fairies. I don't think my life was that bad. <laughs> uh, you nah. think? I don't think I'll qualify for the fairies. Oh, oh, Kone kids next door. I'll be a kid. I'll be fire. I think that's tough. I'll be. Fire. I think that's it right there. But it's like, all right. The 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 thing is, I them have, niggas, them niggas was stru- was dodging death. They were. They was fighting each other. They was literally like fighting each other. Yeah, they I was, think that's fire. That's crazy. Think about it. Like those are grown ass men trying to kill some kids. <laughs> 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 grown ass men just beating on kids, beating on kids, trying to kill them. Oh wow. Now that's that like a that's like a that, now to think about it, that's crazy. That's crazy. Oh my god. And them niggas was whooping their ass. Yeah, the kids was whooping their ass, bro. <laughs> that's tough. You was getting no wonder they want to kill them kids. Yeah, them <laughs> niggas was whooping their ass. Just oh my god, bro. Nah, but can you grow in there? You know, uh, you know how to, when you when you, when you turn you grow, like thirteen, they erase they, your memory. They, yeah. but I'm just gonna go with the teens. You going with it? Oh yeah, that's true. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll, find I'll be my a code way. name. I'll yeah. be a code name kid next door. Let me think. What else? Uh, Wait, are you your age right now? Oh, that's what I was thinking. Like, would it, would I be my age? I don't think I would. I think it would. Yeah, that'd, that'd be, be if, if I'm my age right now, that'd be so ass. Yeah, that'd be an adult right by then, anyway. Oh, let me find one more show and we're gonna think about it. <laughs> the Boondocks. Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> we just go. This is, we just living our life right now, man. Yeah, that's really all that we're doing. Uh, Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. Hell no. A lot that, of shit went on. Yeah, that's. Hey, I don't want to be Irwin. <laughs> you really gonna be Irwin, bro? <laughs> I don't want to be Erwin. <laughs> Erwin was a bitch. Erwin just got like motherfucking. <sighs> I think uh, maybe the right, reg- maybe regular show. Hell nah, hell no. no. I'm Too ass. many shit went on regular That's show. Ass. All right, I got, I got to find a good one. Chowder. You just I eat. was gonna think about chowder. Chowder, but, lit. I, you just but, eat food? But, chow- but chowder, chowder, like it's just where they live is just such a weird area. Area. I know. Like I think they live on top of a. Guy's per- head, yeah, uh, per- yeah, yeah. Like, like person that's holding up, like yeah. the the place. Mm, nah, and I like they know. could literally fall off the edge of the, the edge of their, yeah. their, their, their life. Yeah, <sighs> the I don't know, man. World. People, wait, what cartoon do you think you guys go to? Yeah, bro? what what cartoon would you be like an NPC on? Like just NPC, you don't got no powers. You don't got no powers. Let's know in the comments, bro. No. Let's know in the comments. Oh, okay, but what if you did have powers? Oh, if I did have powers, yeah. I'm gonna go to. I, okay, at my age right now. At your age right now, I am going to probably going. To, I'm probably going to some anime. To be honest, what anime are you going to? Probably Naruto. Well, I mean, if I if I get the powers that I go in there, I'll probably do. Fuck, nah, that's Naruto is kind of tough. God damn it! Maybe Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, maybe. Uh, yeah, Saiyan. but nah, I'm, the hell no. Nah, nah. I think I, yeah, I want Dragon more Ball modern. Z, yeah. I think I go to gra- no, not Gravity Falls. Gravity Ooh. Falls. Gravity Falls is kind of it's a new adventure every day. I like going adventures. Yeah, but, but them pa- them just is scary. Gravity Falls used to scare me. Uh, that was okay. You don't remember? Oh, I'll be Teen Titans. I'll go to Teen Titans. You go to Teen Titans? Yeah, I'll be a Teen Titan. Yeah, Wait, I mean, 20. I'm old as hell. Yeah, yeah. you're 23. Damn, fuck. Uh, uh shit. You're not to see no more, my boy. <sighs> That's when you Young try. Justice. Do I count for Young Justice? Do you? I might. I think you do. Okay, if I I'll be in Young Justice. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I think I think I, I think, take that. I think, I think that. Uh, think Nightwing is probably in his twenties. Yeah, Nightwing is pretty pretty old. Pretty old. Uh, yeah, I'll okay. take that. I'll take You'll that. Take I'll take that. Hey. You watching? Young Justice is tough. I'm I'm watching all the DC AMUs right now. All that's, the movies. That's I'm tough. On, I'm already, I just finished. Uh, what I just watched? Fuck! I watched Reign of Superman. Oh, I didn't watch that. That shit. Nah, top. My top three as of right now, it's uh, Death to Superman. That shit was so sad. He got his ass whooped. Oh, by Doomsday? Doomsday, yeah. yeah. I, Death, I, to, I Death to Superman. Uh, was it Was it Bat- Batman versus Robin? That shit was hard. And oh, was that the one with uh, Red Hood? I think I so. It might have been. It was when his, his mother tried to kill him. Was trying to uh, take over the world and shit. Whose oh, mother? Uh, Robin's mom. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, I didn't watch that. That one was tough, and uh, Teen Times the Judas Contract. Oh, that yeah. was hard. That one's good. That was hard. That I was like hard. That, that gave him hella nostalgia after that yeah. one. Bro. <laughs> hella nostalgia. That was good. Free Beast Boy, bro. Yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, people, let us know what y'all think, bro. What cartoon do y'all think y'all will go into if you was an NPC or if you did have power? Just let us know in the comments down yeah, below. Yeah, yeah. But um, all right. Before I get into the last, would you rather? I got one more thing I want to talk about. 
you know, it's a new uh, category we're going on the show. It's called Urban Legends from Each State. So people, uh, comment down below what state you're from, and we're going to put in like a little, uh, what's that called? In a little in a little wheel, and we're going to spin it, so it'll be randomized every time. So this week, we got Connecticut. So we got Urban Legends from Connecticut, and I found one Urban Legend, and it's called, all right, it's the Legends of like, you know, it's called the Melon Heads. Okay. What so... So supposedly back in the 1960s, uh, an insane asylum, an insane asylum burnt down, killing a lot of the workers and a lot of the patients. But supposedly 10 to 20 of the patients were like uncalled for, like they don't know what happened to them. But there's a there's a there's a legend that they said they got they went to the woods and how they survived from the cold of like Connecticut, because you know it's cold as hell up there. Mm. They survived by like eating each other uh, and like inbreeding with each other and oh like they're in God. they're mentally deranged people so they're making just so they're just wowing in the woods oh and then they say like over time like the through generations they start getting like um they start growing like fluids in their in their heads it's like a it's like a condition i forgot what it's called and it's like they start having their heads start growing and like bigger and they just look like like aliens, like their heads just look like melons. That's why they call it melon heads. Yeah. And there's a so the folklore goes that whoever trespasses in their territory in the woods, like they'll kill them and eat them. Oh shit! I don't know if that's tr- I don't know if it's true or not. That's people, in Connecticut. It's in Connecticut, it? like, and they don't know where like the the specific place is because like they move around a lot, but like they just live off the land. They just live off like the forest and just like hide in there. And whoever like gets too close, they kill them. Honestly, low key. <clears throat> when when did this uh thing come out? Like did this uh the the know? fire happened in the sixties, but I think people started seeing them around the nineties, maybe nineties, early two thousand. You don't think some of them like died from having the condition or died from you know from just, eating each other? I feel like a lot of them did. Like I feel like it might be just like a an urban like myth. Low key, I'd believe. So, uh, some shit like that. You would? I would. That's scary. Like I'd, I'd, I'd be that scared for for me to like, like to believe, go into the woods yeah, type to shit. Go to the woods and be like, uh, nah, I'm not doing. Like that. what I'm if like heads this and there? Nah. Like I could believe that. Like they just like it's just like a group of them. Just I really could believe that. And they're just like running through the tree. Like they know the land, so like they could just sneak up on you and just kill you. Wait, so. The fire actually happened. Mm-hmm. It was in the sixties. I forgot. Yeah, it was a. It was an like insane that. asylum in uh, Fairfield County. I believe some Connecticut, like and like literally, they just escaped. And like you know, they're mentally deranged people. Yeah, like so insane asylum. That's crazy, bro. I ain't insane, gonna lie. Yeah, that's it. I would never want to work there. Me neither. You you gotta have a good heart to work there. Oh no yeah, cap. you gotta have a good heart, a brave, brave soul. soul. I am not doing that I, shit. I can't do that. You got even, me yo. Ha- even not trying to be rude. Like even like. Having like, you know, special like even doing like special needs like that's still a lot of work. Mm-hmm. You know, Hell yeah, insane. Like there's schizophrenia. They there's there there's some of them might have killed people. God. Hell yeah. Hell no, you got me fucked up. Hey, like you, they're just hearing shit in their head, head like head like crazy. Yeah, bro. Right, bro. Like, bro. Get oh, that shit away from me. Oh, I, I forgot. To- I forgot to tell you. I forgot to tell you earlier about the some shit happened to me before. Like I, I was gonna talk about when we was doing the the, the sleep paralysis shit. So like I was I was about to go to bed and like I hear something in my room. It sounded like a siren, and like it's like it's like a mm, mm, I'm like, what the fuck is that? I I go to this window because I usually leave it open like because it's hot, and I try to close it, but it's closed already. So I'm like. Hmm. Okay. So then I just I make sure all my windows are closed, so it's not from outside. Cause I heard it in here. It was yeah. like a like a like a siren, like a siren, or like I thought it was like a car. I was like, mm, mm. I'm like, and then I, in the morning I asked my mom. I was like, Mom, did you hear that? Oh, she's like, boy. she's like, she's like, yeah, it happens all the time. I was like, What you it mean it happens all the time? time? She's like, she thinks it's like the people that's working construction over there. I'm like, Mom, oh. they're not working construction. They just built it already. Like they built, Ooh. they built. Like she, th- it was three thirty in the morning. Who's working construction at three thirty in the morning? And like, like there's, like, they're building like a, a storage unit over there. They finished the, the building it already, so like there's mm-hmm. no like machines. Oh shit! I don't know what's in my house, but I think you it's know, a Filipino you, thing. Nah, you, a Filipino thing. Yeah. You know what's crazy? Yeah, I should, I should, I should have said this before too. 
I've been hearing some weird shit in my crib too. Like what? I put that on everything, and I feel like it's cause it's after, uh, it's after your podcast, my boy. What happened? You brought some shit in my house. <laughs> what Anyways, happened? so, so I'm like, first of all, I be hearing like footsteps. Uh huh. Like upstairs. There's no upstairs. Like it's it's my crib. I'm already upstairs. Yeah, yeah. All in my <laughs> in my house and like in my like in my room. Mm-hmm. I just be hearing like footsteps, like like just like tapping, like tapping, like above me. What the hell? I'm like, yo, what is that? <laughs> and then one time, I went, I went, uh, I was going upstairs, um, inside my room. Yeah. Then once I. You know, got upstairs, was walking past the stairs. I'm hearing, I heard somebody go downstairs. Nigga, I looked down. There's nobody there. I swear to God, bro. Nah, that's scary. I was like, yo, I literally looked down. I was like, <laughs> I'm looking down. I'm like, yo, what is that? You like, you hear him going down the it, stairs. It just quick go downstairs. Straight like that. Nah, that's creepy. I was yo. like, what? That's creepy, yo. Yo, I, I cool, swear, bro. bro I, I, shit, I don't know. Shit just been going on in my crib, bro. Oh, I bro. just I just ignore it. I, I just think we have like a happy no, troll in that, the house. That's what I'm saying. Me too. Like, I'll ignore it. Yeah. But just don't like, don't hurt me. Yeah, nothing. that's what I'm saying. Like, you, can, you can walk you around can my crib. Whatever you just don't, do. don't, don't touch me. Because yo. like, I believe in you regardless. Facts, I believe like, in ghosts. Ghost, ghost, yeah. So... Just don't don't try to hurt me. Yeah, bro. Don't, don't, I'm cool, That's bro. Really it, Cause I burned the house down, bro. <laughs> Keep playing with me, bro. Hey, bro. Hey, but I think I think we I think we should end it off there, bro. If y'all haven't That's already, bro. If y'all haven't already, follow us on all podcasts and platforms at No Regus Podcast on Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, all that good stuff. If y'all new to the channel, subscribe down below. Hit the comment section. Go comment down whatever you want to want to talk about. All Go, that. You know what I'm saying. Like like the video up. Send it to a friend. Tell them to send it to a friend. Share the video. And people, if y'all want to talk to us, like you know, go to our social medias. I'm more. Like I really reply back to people on Instagram because like it's easier to see. So if you want to talk to me, all that stuff, mm. and if you just want to just like tell us how we're doing or like how you enjoy the podcast, because I I can't listen to it every day. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like shout out to y'all that be listening to us weekly, man. I think it's like about it's like about 200 people, mm-hmm. like that be That's listening. Tough. That's tough. I shout out to y'all, bro. Weekly, bro. Shout you out to y'all, I'm man. Shout out to my nigga Fritz, bro. On, bro. Thanks for pulling up again, man. Hey, man. No problem. Thank you for having me. You know, it's always an honor to be in the podcast you know i i love I, lo- I like doing this i like talking about new shit like this you, you know, know what i'm saying, saying? we're I going up in the world bro you got That's anything it. else you want to say my brother uh subscribe to the youtube get get that shit to you know 1500 subscribers Almost uh there. by the end of this this uh this week this week what day is it today today is saturday the 9th by the end of this week Get it, get one one hundred fifty thousand on TikTok. Oh, let's see, let's see, maybe by maybe. the end of this week. And um, oh, I almost forgot to tell y'all. Right. Uh, merch coming soon, people. Logo, new logo coming soon. Shout out my guy in UK who's making my little logo and shit like that. Shout out to him. It's gonna be fire, you know bro. What I'm saying it's gonna be fire. Right, so I seen the design, bro. It's coming crazy. It's coming crazy. We going up, crazy. man. The merch probably we're looking to aim dropping towards the summertime. So we got a lot of summertime fits for y'all people that wear some bummy clothes, man. We got y'all. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, go look fly, bro. Hold on. Pull up to school with that? That's nigga. fire, What? Bro. That's fire. Don't be the flyest person in there. That's like, what I'm what saying, bro. New school clothes, bro. You good, bro. <laughs> <laughs> shout out to y'all, man. We different than regular no regulars, man. Gangsta. I'm going to go get it. I'm going to go get it. I'm going to go get it.